Lovely people. Can I get a round of applause in the chat for all of those lovely people? They're lovely. They really are. Man, it's time for the mullet, dude. I think it's long enough. I think it's long enough. What do you reckon, chat? Yay or nay? Long enough for the mullet? Brrr. Now, are you still in chat? Now's gonna hate my idea. Now's gonna hate my idea. Oh my god, now's gonna fucking hate it. Now's gonna hate my idea. So my idea, chat, is to get a mullet. And then I'm gonna get a rat's tail right here on the long bit of it. Mullet. Brrr. And then a and then a braid. And then a little braid here on the mullet. Little braid. Oh yeah. Going full bogan. Going full leave me alone vibes. You know what I mean? Like full like do not talk to me vibes. That's that's what I want. That's a bold statement. It's a good statement, no? It's a good statement. It, it's a it's a leave me alone statement. You know, it's a leave me alone statement. I reckon it's good. Yay or nay for it. What do you reckon, chat? What haircut do you guys have? Describe your hair to me. What hair do you guys have? What what hair do you guys have? Yeah, but the rat's tail is like extra, like leave me alone, you know? Like the, the rat's tail is extra. Yeah, mullet with a Jedi plat. Yeah, exactly. Mullet, mullet. Yeah, a lot of mullets going around. Short back and sides. I almost, you know Levi's haircut from Attack on Titan? I almost want to get it shaved all the way around and have it like going over. Mm. Shitty comb over with long hair. It happens. That's a classic. That's a classic one. That is a classic. That's OG right there. I respect that. I respect that. Seriously. Respect it. Mm. I have the average white dude haircut. What is that? Is that mine? <laughs> is mine the average white dude haircut? I feel like I want my hair up like this. I feel like showing a bit of forehead makes you look good. Show a little bit of the forehead, you know, but then it just flops down, dude. But I want it to stay up like this. You know, I want it to stay. You know what I'm saying, Chad? Like, I want it up, but it won't stay up. I don't know how to get it to stay. I think you got to just do something to it, eh? Just got to do something to it. Crew cut. What is a crew cut? What is a crew cut, chat? Is crew cut nice? I don't know what a crew cut is. I don't know what a crew cut is. What is a crew cut? Short all over. Oh, that's what a crew cut is. Crew cut's cool. Scarlet, I can't lie, man. Here I am talking about uh, uh, bloody uh, rat's tails, but Scarlet is too far. You know, imagine me with a Scarlet. Oh my God. Fuck that. <laughs> Screw that. Get waves, bro. <laughs> you reckon the waves on me, chat? You reckon the waves? You reckon the waves? All right, all right. True, the waves? Damn, okay. Wave check, man. Mm. My hair is really thin. No matter what I do, it just gets a, a messed up from the slightest bit of wind. That must suck. I got thick hair and it, st it still messes up. You know, did Loser Fruit get 100 crown wins? I'm unsure. Did she? I'm unsure. Did she get 100 crown wins? I don't know. Bert's waiting. What? No, she's not. Bert is waiting. Ahem. <clears throat> Hello, Berticus. How are you feeling today? Hello. You scared me there. Oh, sorry. I'm good. How are you? You ready you. to debate? I love debating with you. It's one of my favorite things. It's uh, it's an old pastime of ours, I think, I feel. Mm. Oh, my God. Why do you sound like a fucking robot? What do you mean, robot? Oh, we're already debating. <laughs> Round of applause. Yeah, we get it. You've been avoiding me, and now you feel awkward oh, because you're fucking fuck. with me. We'll get that out of the way. <laughs> Let's not get that out of the way, because I would never avoid you. Uh-huh. I would never avoid you. Shut what? up. You're such a little liar. I can't with you. I can't with you. Oh, what is happening? Don't I'm... sit here and pretend like you, okay? We I'm, get it. I'm not avoiding You're you. You're pettier than I thought you were. That's all I'm, I'm saying. I'm not petty. I'm not doing anything. Thing. I'm chilling. Yeah, well, you're doing a bit. I'm not doing anything. We can talk about it off stream. Thank you for the bit. You are. You, oh yeah, exactly. You are fucking petty. I'm not petty. Mm-hmm. There's oh Magui chat. Shut up, chat. Shut up. You don't. No. No. You must start your gameplay at the exact same time as your streaming partner to ensure that you both have enough time to debate in the scenario. Okay. Okay. Do you think you're good at debating, Bert? I think I'm great, creator. 
Yeah, do you think I'm good at debating? Are we doing co-op or solo? You're good at lying. <laughs> Am I a good liar or a bad liar, Bert? you got to pick one, man. I'm just kidding. You're good at thinking you're good at lying. You're fucking terrible. I don't. I would never lie to you. I uh-huh. care for you too deeply to lie to you. Oh, do you now? Yeah, I care for you oh, too deeply. Oh, that's interesting, isn't it now? Yeah. Very interesting. All right. Are we, is it co-op or solo? There's a special mode we have to be in. Um, hang on, I'm just going through the game right now. I'm just going through it right now. Hang on one moment, please. Yeah, can you go through that a little bit quicker, please? Yeah, sorry. sorry I love lady. playing games with creator. Do you? I'm your biggest mm-hmm. fan. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, fuck. Hang on, let me... I accidentally, I accidentally hit something. I have to um, restart the whole game. What does my title have to be? Where's my stream title? Oh, you just got to do that. It's, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's okay. actually not much. Oh. Um, um, First of all... Big debate. thank you to Yogcast for thank sponsoring so both much. Frey and I's stream today. Claps in the Round chat. Yogcast for sponsoring today's stream with debating. It's going to be fun with my amazing streamer friend, Creator. Yep, that's me, guys. Hello, everyone. Streamer yep. friends for life. Mm. Get ready for a whole lot of agreements. For this stream, you know? For this stream, yeah, yeah. For this stream. Yeah, uh-huh. Because we have to be. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm pretty sure that's the only reason you're here. Oh, oh my god! So sit tight. We got two hours. Okay, hang on. Players count two. Hang on. How do the I? Following game contains adult. Themes. Following game contains adult does themes. It does not contain. Language, sexual. Content, One second, please. Horror or show violence. Choices matter. So please. That's rude. Hang on. I think I've got this. Just setting it Actions all up. Actions speak louder than words. Hang on, did I just... Welcome to Trolley Problem, Inc. Founded to help people travel safely across Hang the on. nation. I'm just trying to figure Four out this... values. Responsibility, integrity, and respect. It's a weird Friday, hey? Start your it is a weird Friday. Hang on, I'm trying to figure out how I get yeah, into this game. Down the railway oh, hang on. No, that's the... That, that's the... Hang on, All wait. right. Look at the mode. You must start playing at the exact same time with your streaming partner creator. Ensure that you both have time to debate each scenario. The game is linear. You both will present it with the same scenarios. Take your time to debate each scenario with your partner. They want 15 to 25 minutes on each problem. And they want four to five completed at the end of the stream. I'm confused if we click co-op or if they want us just clicking solo at the same I think time. maybe we click solo. I have a at the same time. That's yeah. what I'm thinking. That's what I think they want us to do. Yeah. All right. Well, when you're ready to click it, let me know. Okay, hang on one second, please. Wait, okay. Just, I know, I'm yeah. I know you're out. quoting me, Adam. Somebody put on my uh, questions the other day, chat. I was telling Craig's stream, but I haven't told my stream yet. They asked if Cray and I have touched piss holes together yet. <laughs> Can, we are sponsors. <laughs> Let's debate, I debate that. about I that don't, one. I don't ah! think we have. Oh, what the fuck? All right, are you hovering over solo? Yeah. Okay. Three, go. Three, two, two one, go. go. No, don't. Go. What? I clicked that. I don't need to click wait, it. Wait, and now there's and now there's a thing. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna say it. Three, two, one, go. The Got it. The following game contains adult themes. It does not contain explicit language. Oh, then we write our signature. Horror or show. Oh God, I can't. Can I not do that on stream? Yours is bad too. Mine's great. Mine is fantastic. Hovering over continue. Well, I'm not going to do a proper one. What if somebody like, you know, forges it? Showing you understand and agree to endorse every real one. I was about to do my real one. I love how they have to do the, uh, this signature is no way binding or even used. Oh, wait, I clicked next without even thinking about it. Really? You click continue without even thinking about it? Yeah. Action. Responsibility. Oh, well, you're out. Oh, Bert! Welcome to Trolley, Welcome to Trolley Problems. Alright, I'm um, ready to click next. The I already three. clicked continue! Must show three core values. You told me you click continue! Oh, wait, next, okay, wait, um, wait, don't click it! Wait, quick, I clicked it! 34 minutes. Wait, shh, shh. What are you doing? There's a run rate. Oh, There's a trolley <laughs> barreling. Th- Listen. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh. Quick, 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 quick! There's a trolley barreling down the railway tracks on the tracks of five people unable to move. You are next to the lever. If you pull this lever, the trolley will switch to a different set of tracks. However, you notice one person still on the other track. What do you do? Pull the fucking lever. Wait. 
You are next to a lever. If you pull the lever, trolley will switch to a different set of tracks. However, you notice it's just killing one person rather oh, than five. I pull five. the lever because that's called utilitarianism, and I'm, I believe in utilitarianism. What's? I don't even know what that utilitarianism word. Utilitarianism is the uh, belief that the majority wins over the the minority. So, like, if I can save five people rather than one, I save the five. That's utilitarian. Yeah, yeah, that's what I believe in too. Round of applause! Wow, we're How agreeing. Oh, now he's dead. <laughs> Usually we don't expect candidates to kill someone on their first day. Okay, we're going to think we'll this time. The benefit of the doubt on this one. We agree with 65% before acting next time. I mean like, you know what I mean? Yeah, no, it makes uh, sense. All right, finish. ready? Hit it in 3, 2, 1, go. Yep. Yeah. If it ain't broke. We got an achievement called utilitarian. Oh. This test Okay. Will this test will focus principle responsibility. Polly. Here's Polly. She's 5 years old. While she loves to play in the sand with her dolls, she dreams of looking after the world. Polly's destiny is to grow up to be a great doctor. It's Magui. Oh, should take a leaf out of her book. Ready? All right, three, two, one, go. A trolley is heading towards another five people. Okay. You're next to a lever. If you pull this lever, the trolley will derail and descend down a hill heading for the park's sand pit. Ah, I see what they're doing. You notice that Polly is in the sand pit. <laughs> see you, <ya>, Polly! <laughs> yeah, I was going to say. Pull the lever! I don't care if you're, I don't care oh, if you're an old wait, person. We've got to decide, decide together. I pulled the lever. I'm pulling it, Bert. Great, we've got to decide these together. I'm taking I'm charge here. Say, it's only a kid, though. Like, it's I only know, one kid. What if, no, but listen, what if they're like criminals or some shit? Who cares? YOLO. Ah, Polly. Sorry, Polly's Polly. Polly's got to die, you know? It's one Wait, versus five. I think we have an option to do nothing. Whoopsies. I pulled the lever. Achievement unlocked. Killed a child. <laughs> Yay! That is an odd take on being responsible. It's still like one to five. 53%. We're in the majority still. We're owning. <laughs> Put that on your resume. The death of a young girl. Polly wants to be a doctor now, but I also want to be like an astronaut. So like, it's probably unlikely she was ever going to become a doctor. No offense, Polly shouldn't have had to go like that, but it was Polly to five. So mm -hmm. three, two, one, finish. This is actually kind of interesting. I love it. Justifies the means. Oh, does it? Oh, this might be where we disagree. This okay. Integrity. This is Tyrone. He is a 30 year old secretary at a law firm who enjoys binge-watching crime mm. shows. Tyrone is a very large man. You don't really know anything else about him, apart from the fact that he has a severe phobia of trains. Well, that's going to be bad in the game called uh, Trolley Problems. <laughs> Jesus Christ, here we go. Okay, next. Hit next. Oh, now Bert. Okay. The ante. You're on a bridge. You are on a bridge with Tyrone, watching a trolley speeding towards five people again. You can only stop it by deliberately pushing Tyrone off the bridge. It's the same as time. always. You push Tyrone. I'm pushing Tyrone. <laughs> it's not that hard. You can push Tyrone. See, get... Tyrone has that fear of trolley. Hey, thank God he's big enough to stop it. <laughs> well, it doesn't know. Okay, hang on a minute. Just because he's terrified of trains. I'm sure the little girl who wasn't terrified of trains is terrified of getting hit by one. Exactly. She died. What do you Tyrone's mean, Tyrone? gonna die. Dude, if I push the kid, I'm obviously pushing I've got Tyrone. To push Tyrone. You're about to be featured in a crime show. You should be grateful. Uh oh. The cleaning Finally. With the best reviews are Happy Cleaning Limited. Forty-three percent. Make so much. Wait, how many people like Tyrone? Goddamn. Why'd you like Tyrone so much, but fifty-three percent ki kill the kid? What? <laughs> what? Oh, because they're associating pushing with murder rather than pulling a lever. But little do they know that there's no difference because it is cause. They're causing it anyway. It's literally, so, yeah, it's literally the same thing. I think this is where we're going to debate about it. Yeah, so debate. Do you agree that we should have pushed Tyrone? Yeah, 100%, because it's like, it's still five to one. Like, it's like, there was this similar, like, thing in Saw where it was like an old, this one's actually more complicated, and I'm curious to what you think. Hmm. In Saw, they had, like, an old lady who was loved by so many. She was probably, like, you know, 70. Loved by heaps. Probably still got, like, another, like, 10 15 years if she's lucky mm -hmm. absolutely love everyone on the other side was a crack junkie young impossibility to change his life but he's you know nobody he's got absolutely nobody in his life and they've got to kill one of them so who do you kill i'll kill the old lady you'd kill the old lady see in that scenario i'd kill the junkie oh, oh! the old lady's already lived her life 
You know, she'll be missed and whatever. Like, yeah, but it's it's time for the old lady to go. Like, the junkie still has time um, to make up for his life and do great things. The old lady has already done great things. So there's potential with the young fellow. But the old lady, she might be gone in six months. Like, I would rather sacrifice my 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 elderly grandma for the sake that a young man or young woman gets to change their life over her living, what, an extra year? Screw True. that. Yeah, but, like, the reality, like, and I'm not saying, like, it's a terrible situation. It's bad for both. Um, mm. You kind of, sorry, I'll answer that question in a minute. Think of the biddies. But, like, it's kind of, one is loved and, like, there's still quite a few more years. Like, somebody's, like, mother, all of this, right, that, like, they could have grandchildren and stuff. Like, they're very loved. And I get it's only 15 years, but the junkie could probably OD tomorrow. Like, he's been, True. obviously, had it hard and I apologize. Like, I sympathize for the guy. But the reality is, like, to actually get out of that rut is fucking hard. So he could honestly get back on the street tomorrow and then just, you know, shoot up and be gone. So I'd rather take my chances with the lady whose family's going to be, like, happy to see her again than to take my chances with someone who's very, like, it, the likelihood of, like, a heroin junkie, you know, getting over it is so slim. So, like, the mm. only look, like, in my, I see, I see both sides, but I honestly would probably pick the grandma because, like, it sounds horrible, but no one's going to miss the junkie. A lot of people are going to miss the grandma. See, the, w the way I see it is a matter of potential. So the grandma no longer has potential. She's lived her life. She's fulfilled things. The she's had goals. Potential. He could just continue being a junkie. He could, but there's the opportunity for it. You know what I mean? But the old lady, she's she's old. She gone. She dead. She already lived. Yeah, but she's not dead. She could have another 15 years in it. That's like saying your mum right now has only got 15 more, like, you know, say she was older, 15 more years in it. Like... I even think, like, maybe my mum is different, but if I told my mum this question, my mum would say to sacrifice herself and give it to the yeah, junkie. Yeah, which is an honourable thing to do. Yeah, my mum's great. Mm. Shout out to mum. She's probably watching. Chat. Hey, mum. Both chats. Press one in the chat for the old lady. You'd kill the old lady. Press two in the chat if you'd kill the junkie. I'm killing the old lady. She gone. Sorry. Junkie has a chance. He's young. He has a chance to make up for a lot of his two, life. Two was a junkie, yeah, wasn't it? What happens if you kill the junkie, chat? Everyone's and, he cures, too. and he cures cancer. But the old lady, she ain't going to do that. She's already lived her life. She's gone to school. She might. She's, She's got, got 15 years no, at least in her school. No, no, no. Nah. No. Nah. Kill she, both. Fuck it. She ain't doing nothing. <laughs> it's unfair to decide. Sorry, you both have to go. Dun, dun, dun. Grandma could be dead tomorrow. She might not um, even remember please, who she please. is tomorrow. Shut the fuck. Somebody did, if you saw a disaster coming on a bridge, would you push M off in a split second if you thought it might save? No, but it's different if I know the person. This is where my morals change. If I knew the person, though, this is how you can make it harder, okay? So first of all, no. If it's someone I knew, sorry, the five people, you're out. <laughs> See ya. Oh. I'm picking somebody I know over five people, 100%. Yeah, who wouldn't? But, okay, now it's five people that you know and one person that you know. What if it's like five of your friends and then it's your mum on the train tracks? What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> I'd have to uh I'd have to kill my mum. Great! Yeah, mum's gonna go because mum would hate me if I didn't like if I didn't do that, my mum because I know she's a good person, um, I know she would hate me forever. Like she would think that I made because my mum raised me the other way, you know what I mean? So if I betrayed my mum like that and let all these young people die, my mum could never live with herself knowing that she has the burden of living the rest of her life, having killed five of my friends who are still, you know, have potential. Mm. Which goes I think back I to the, the other question as well, you know, like mum's a bit older. It's like the younger person has more potential. Well, my mum answered this question once. She said if my brother and I were drowning, she'd let us both drown. Not because she didn't love us, but because she couldn't pick between us. No, that I'm, she picking, would drown I'm picking with one. Us. I'm picking no, one. See, mum, mum said she'd drown with us because she's not picking. I'm picking. Like, I'm making a choice. I'm, I'm saving someone. You reckon? Yeah. No, oh, you yeah. Never, like... I, can, I can live with somebody else dying as long as I've saved. I've done something. Inaction is an action within itself of not choosing. So then you've I'd chosen. Be, I'd be fine if mum just decided. I'd be more pissed if I drowned, watch my mum save my brother. But if she just decided, oh, fuck it, you can both drown, I'd be fine with that. Imagine the last memory you have before you're dead. Is you see your mum saving your oh, You fucking best bet I'm coming back to Hornham. You fucking best bet I'm going to be a vengeful spirit. Like, <laughs> I'm taking up my whole family out of spite. Oh, man. Next one, next one. All right, three, two, one, go. Let's go. 
A cat has nine lives. Okay. Ah, right on. Now for the final core value. Oh God. Respect. Mm -hmm. It seems we've run out of resources to continue your testing. I'm going to need you to go and grab some mannequins. Mannequins? You will hmm. need to take the next trolley, so don't get distracted by that dog. The trolley leaves. I swear to God, if they're going to put a dog into this, they're going to. Gonna they're good. going to. Three, two, one, go. There is a dying dog down oh God. on the tracks. No trolleys will use that line today, so the dog will not be hit. You're in a rush. Do you kill the dog, putting it out of its misery, or leave it to die? I'm kill the dog. Alone. Why are these my only options? I would take it to the vet. No, nah, you got to choose one, Bert. Which one is it? How are you going to do, do you it? You kill the dog, putting it out of its misery. I would never do that. I would take it to the vet, or I would sit there and die with it. A man is missing a best friend. You got to drive past. One. You got to leave it. You got to. You choose I'm one, Bert. I'm not choosing. You're not one. answering. I'm not answering. It's made me pick this one. I would never leave it. None of these are anything that I'd ever do. When you respect something, you're it, it would be very hard, but if I think if I came across an animal dying of any kind, I could not in good conscience turn my back and walk away from a dying animal listening to it and whatever. Like it's in suffering, it's gonna die alone. It might as well die with like somebody um, with him or her, you know, being there, and then you know, I'll end it for it. But I'm not gonna leave. No, okay, I understand. To okay, I think a better scenario of this mm -hmm. is you're driving in the middle of Australia, and this has happened to my mum back in the day when she had a boyfriend that wasn't my dad. Mm -hmm. uh, hit a kangaroo, right? Because yeah. it's a night, and it happens often. It's on the road. It's in agony. It's dying. There's no vet anywhere nearby. So the guy got out and he shot it. Yep. I would 100 percent condone that like shoot the kangaroo in that situation because it's going to have like a slow horrible death but yep. i wouldn't go to that option without exhausting other options first like if i would google on my phone nearest vets i would bring it to the vet i would try everything i can to like keep it alive yeah but if i had no options yeah i would kill it because i do believe like if i was in that situation i'd want to be taken out of my misery rather than like sitting there in agony yeah i think the yeah i think the question is you know you can't do anything else. You know, the dog is dying. You can in that train situation. In the train situation? Yeah, because no trains are going on there. You can get on the tracks, pick that dog up and take it to a vet. That's why it's yeah, a but Bert, scenario. Let, yeah, but let's say, let's say, Bert, that you can't. Which one no, is it? No, but you can. That's why it's yeah, a super but, scenario. Uh, yeah, but Bert, you can't change the question. You're changing no, I'm it. I'm changing it because no. it's dumb, that one. No, I just that one's say, not dumb. I don't think you understand how, like, uh, how extreme I go in animals. I was a, like a magpie hurt at an over once on a 40 something degree day. I spent four hours running around trying to get this bird to take it to the vet Four fucking hours for like a random magpie. And I ended up getting Harlow at the car to help round it up. And she did round it up. And then I took it to the vet Four hours. It was a bird. I don't care if it's a four hour walk to the vet. I'm carrying that dog to the vet. Yeah. But the question is, is that you can't help. You can't help. You can't. That's, well, I disagree because you can help. No, but you can't. It's either it dies alone and afraid and without somebody by its side or you kill it while you're by its side yeah, but, giving it No, comfort. but I can't answer because I'm not that uh, arsehole of a person where I'm like, so I'm a bit busy today. I can't. Sorry, sir. I'd call in and be like, sorry, can't come in today. There's this poor animal dying. And if I got fired about it, I'd be like, GG's, you're inhuman, inhumane, disgusting. Puh. Cancelling your company. Yeah, but you're changing it, Bert. I can change it because it's a dumb scenario. You I don't can't like change scenario. it. I'm changing the scenario. <laughs> it's, if they said you're in the middle of nowhere, absolute middle of nowhere, middle of nowhere, you can't help it. That's it. That's Whatever. the question. No, but not saying you can change the question in that way, but you can't change it in the other way, can no, you? No, but that's not change. It is saying it's saying you can't stop the train, but you can. Wait, what the fuck is the question? <laughs> it's, no, it's just it's leave the dog alone, cold and miserable to die and not have action, not get off the train and drive straight past it. You're in the middle of nowhere. You hit the dog. The dog's dying on the side of the road. Do you keep driving or the train um, keeps going? Or are you getting off to end that dog's life, but to end it quickly so it's as painless as can be so it doesn't suffer? Say it's going to sit there. 
and die for like five hours, it's like, I'm going to end that dog's life. Like, I'm going to end that kangaroo's life. Like, the kangaroo has to die. The animal, it, it's, we're out in the middle of nowhere. We can't stop. I'm not going to let an animal have unnecessary suffering. I'll take that burden on myself. I will be like, it's time for you to go. You know what I mean? Like, you're not going to make it. You know, it would be like, say you, say replace the dog with you and you're dying on the side of the road. Would you want someone to get off the train and to kill you and to say, hey, you know, and like hold your hand and be this? Or would you want but You're not to even past? holding the animal's hand. You're just leaving it there to get hit by the train. No, no, I think I think you are like ending its life. I, I think, right? No, I think you're leaving it there to get hit by the train, aren't you? Even then, it's better that the dog dies then rather than suffer for 10 hours or, or 5 hours or however long it is. I, I have to end its suffering. Hmm. Anyway. You don't question. agree? You don't agree? No, I think end its suffering, but I don't... I think that scenario doesn't, like, really 100% work. So you've got a problem with the question. I've got a problem with the question still. <laughs> Let's move on. Next one. Three, two, one, Go. If you play with fire, you'll get burned. True. Mm -hmm. I try not to play with fire. Oh, great. I've just heard those kids are back. They keep Little shit! Down onto the tracks. With all the training from this week, you should be able to decide a straightforward outcome for these reprobates. Just remember, respect... Responsibility, responsibility and integrity. That's what I live by. Round of applause in the chat. I live respect, by that. Responsibility and integrity, okay. Ready, set, Go. Five trespassers have snuck down onto the trolley line, even though signs warn them of the dangers. The trolley is currently heading for a co-worker. Do you let your co-worker die or sacrifice the delinquent? I know my co-worker. Fuck, it's that question you said before. Ah, uh, uh, kill trespassers. Fuck yeah, see ya. Sorry. It's a risk you take when you do the risky thing. It's not my co-worker's fault. You would change the path, right? What are you picking, Cray? I'd kill the trespassers, yeah. They gotta yeah. go. Yeah. And the morals are like bending, you know. Whoa, what? <laughs> yeah, I gotta I gotta I'd rather murder those five kids than let my friend die. They gotta go. They're already in the wrong. They're doing something wrong, so they gotta die. You killed five kids. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> really, they were kids. <laughs> yeah. Uh, just walk down the driveway. Wait, Grushy, sorry, what was that, Craig? Nothing, I'm just thinking that I've killed five kids. No, I've got I a dead either, dog and I've killed two people. They kind of are children. I didn't think, I didn't hear the kid part. Yeah, I kind of, I was thinking too much about my co-worker. I don't know, Grushy. even then, like... Yeah, say it was like, say it was like Fruity on the train tracks. I know Fruity, you know, I'm not going to let Fruity die. Like those five but kids. But do I like my coworker? Because that makes a difference. Yeah, yeah, you like, your, it's your coworker. Okay, you like, you you like your coworker, okay. Yeah, yeah, you like the coworker. Like, nah, I'm not letting my coworker die. I don't know those kids. I ain't their fucking dad. Yeah. Uh, they, they kind of put themselves in that situation though. That's where I'm like, I feel bad, but I don't feel that bad because they put themselves in that situation. Chat, thoughts? Yeah, I don't even care that I've um, contradicted um, the idea of potential. I don't care. Like, it's my co-worker. It's my friend. Nah, kids got to die. And they're also initiating in something that is wrong inherently. They have jumped the train tracks. They have done something. So philosophically, it's not exactly the same because they are already doing something that they should not be doing by being um, delinquents. However, my um, co-worker who I know and love is not doing something wrong. Whereas They're just the, doing their job. Exactly. Yeah. Where the junkie and the grandma, I knew neither of them. So I could only base my ideals off of potential rather than basing it off of love and care, which is all wrongdoing, which is here. You definitely do. I've done many things wrong as a kid chat, but I think it's more like I also like you accept the responsibilities when you do something wrong as, as a thing. You can't just expect someone to be like put someone that they know and whatever before like your kid, if that makes sense. Like, yeah. you know, just as a kid, like it's more like it's on the parents for not keeping an eye on what their kids are doing. And it's also when the kids are getting themselves in that situation. Like, obviously, you wouldn't want either or, but I think you'd I, like personally, yeah, I'd, I'd help someone I know. Yeah, I've got to help someone I know. 
oh, I'd hate myself for the rest of my life. Either decision. I wouldn't. Hard question. Three, two, one, go. Is this a letter to tell us we're horrible All right, people? ready? Three, two, one. Oh, I clicked it. Oh, Jesus. Dear sir or madam. <laughs> co-worker is 85 years old. No, it said co-worker. I'm allowed to choose which one in my mind. And, would like to and also, chat, you keep missing the fact that I know my co-worker, which changes the philosophy of it completely. We would like to invite you to take employment at the Trolley Health Corporation, THC. This is a prestigious position and was created to help keep the public safe through all walks of life. Okay. Three, two, two one, go. Oh. Oh fuck, that's right. The best laid plans go astray. Okay. It looks like uh -oh. you've impressed someone upstairs. Oh, a developer's in chat and said there's a Twitch integration that lets chat vote. We should ask Ooh. the chat more questions. We will, yeah. That'd be good. THC is stoic, focusing more on Hang on, wait, I need to temperance, courage, and wisdom. We'll start with justice. Okay, we're starting I with love justice. Oh justice. God. Hey, this is the stuff we all, always talk about. True, true. Do these I, people watch that podcast? Seriously, I think they've they've listened to me and Bert have conversations together. Yeah, then why seriously. why are they were like these two have to stream it together? Are you ready? Ready? Three, two, one, go. Today you'll be in A and E. I want to get chat to vote. A young oh. male has come in from a car accident. We can ask them after. He urgently needs a heart transplant. There's only one in the hospital. And this heart is scheduled to be given to an elderly man waiting upstairs. See ya. He will See ya, old man. Young man. <laughs> Young man has potential. This is where it kind of sucks, right? Because the old man's probably been waiting for such a long time. And this actually happens a lot where they're like, um, you know, wait, I will talk about it after, but I'm picking. Wait, who am I picking? News just in, Which one do you pick, Cray? Elderly man? Alcohol. Who's dying? Which one do I click? Was he I picked, I've got to save the young man. I've got to save the young man. Yeah, it's safe, I've okay. got to give it to the young guy. I'd say young because it's like a bit of a waste of a heart. It's potential. The old yeah, it's potential again. It's literally every episode of Grey's Anatomy, yeah. You made an excellent choice. Well done. Oh. Wait, I <laughs> gave it to the wrong one! Much no, <laughs> the old guy. Oh, wait. Did oh, wait. You save the young guy? Oh, yes, yeah, thank God. Yes, yeah, save the young guy. Did you save the young guy, huh? Yeah, of course. More potential. Oh, wait, now we can talk about it. This happens all the time, but you've been on the list for years. Like, they couldn't be old because Wait, they were we on the list. Wait, we missed the question. It said the young guy was drink driving and the old man was a good person. Oh, wait. Did it say that? Yeah. Fuck! No! I would have picked old man. I didn't... No! Okay, that changes my answer. I would have picked... I would have picked... Oh. I didn't know that. Mm. Change your answer, Craig. Young man still has... A chance to change his life. The old man has already lived it. The old, the young man who drink oh, and drives, he could wake. Chat. He could, he could wake up tomorrow and be a better man and go on a, 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 a. You know when people go through those crazy hardships and then they encourage others not to do bad. Yeah. We okay, we said old people are rarely ever like fit for like heart heart transplants, so it's probably true to be honest. Like young bodies probably take to that better too. Old bodies probably will have a hard time. All the other organs are a bit older. Why would I give like a, a good organ to an old person? Right? I know it sounds very cruel. That is barely going to live many more years, rather than give it to a young person who can still change and do good in society. They can do things. No offense to the elderly, but uh. Wait, yeah. did he kill someone though? Yeah, I think the drunk driver killed someone possibly. He was just drunk driving and crashed. Right. It just makes sense to give it to a young person. Oh, they can't offer it to over someone's 65 year old. Chat, oh. one's in the chat if you would give the heart to the elderly person. Two's in the chat if you would give it did to he, a wait, younger did person. It, did it, yeah. What even, if the, did it, even the younger person has done did something Did it say he terrible. killed someone there? I, don't, I think he was just drink driving. Oh, if he was just drink driving, no, like, fair enough. But if he killed someone, I'd say no, he doesn't deserve it. That's like saying somebody in prison who's on thing for murder, should he have to, like, but he'll be out in, like, 20 years, should he get a heart transplant over somebody who's never committed a crime in his life? Huh? Obviously, I'd say fuck the prisoner. <laughs> See ya. Fuck the okay, prisoner. A, prisoner. a prisoner who's young, right, has got, like, you know, attempted murder or something like that and he's got 15 years in prison and then he's out but he needs a heart transplant where there's a 
45 or a 50 year old man he's waiting to get a heart transplant you've got to decide between the two who are you picking one of them never committed a crime too but he's older old man gotta go prisoner might change some really well you would pick you would pick the prisoner prisoner gotta live you gotta live really here. dead he- set uh, be honest. I think this is where we're going to disagree. No, nah, if he's if he's like a murderer, then then no, I would give it to the innocent man. Um, mm. But for drink driving, no, once, not drink driving. Talking if know, it was a murderer. No, nah, if he's a murderer, he can go fuck himself. Isn't you know? still a human being? Not if you're a murderer. I don't really class you as a human being. If it's like like a really messed up murder, if it's like accidental murder, something like that. Fair There's enough. A difference it's between like, premeditated you're like and Bundy. Actually. You ain't even a person at that point. Like, I oh, disagree. you're not human. You're not human. You're not human to me. I don't really view you as anything. Mm. I think for the, I think for the, this one though, this one, I would still give it to the young man. Military is different. That's different. Like if you've gone out and be like, that is like, yeah, I don't like the comparison with that. That isn't, that is considered because that's different. But I can see where you're trying to say it is different. It is different. This is where it's getting hard. Heart goes to those who are best accepted. The crime shouldn't be taken. I think crime should be taken in consideration. Actions that, that are a- dubbed <laughs> crimes, say murder and things, it's an action, right? Should be taken into consideration because it's a reflection of who you are as a human being. And not everyone is equal in their, in their niceness or, or their contribu- contributions to society. So, for example, if I'm a mass murderer, for, for you to say that that person is equal to, say, a surgeon who saves lives every day... Don't be ridiculous. Like, that is just silly. People are weighed for their actions and their morals and their ethics. And so if if it comes to a prisoner versus an innocent old man, the prisoner has to die. To, to disagree with that is pretty crazy. You know, like, a murderer is still a person, yes, but is if his heart is weighed against a good man who, say, saves lives every day, we save the person who saves lives every day, not the fucking and- murderer. Yeah, and who said, like, people were in, like, war, like, who's fighting for their country is the same as, like, a Ted Bundy. I disagree. Like, one's going out of just, like, the thrill of wanting to kill and, like, that kind of stuff. Like, they get a kick out of it and they're killing, like, people. It's completely different to a soldier. Like, I can see, like, you trying to, like, pull the parallels, but I do think they're, like, very different. Yeah, and also with, with the war comparison to um, a murderer comparison is... Um, you know, we all understand that militaries exist and I th- uh, it's, it's going to get long-winded, but to just say that war or anything should never exist and just lay down your arms and become pacifist is insane. You know, like old men point their fingers and young men die. And to believe that a young man at war is the same as Ted Bundy going around killing... Uh, out of young, free will. Yeah, yeah, out of free will and want and, and, and th- he loves it. That's crazy too, you know, like... And also in defense of that, and like things like World War II and whatnot, like if you didn't drafted, go to war, some yeah. of them were... Yeah, you literally would get like killed or put in prison. Like some of them weren't even like, they were forced to. That's where it like, it gets like crazy. But I do see what like they're trying to say. Magui said like, you know, they take an oath that they have to like, uh, carrying an individual irresponsible with a crime, but that's why I'd make a terrible surgeon. <laughs> they have to do what? They, ha- they take an oath where you can't like judge someone based off of like a crime that they've done or whatever. You have to just treat them as like, you know, never let equal. me. Yeah. Never let me be a surgeon. You dying on that. I table would right struggle. There. Like you, if Ted Bundy came and brought transplant, you're gone. You're done. Sorry. If you were a serial killer and I'm going to save your life. Whoops. Whoopsie. Cyanide. Oh, Whoops. Oh, How'd that get in there? No. Nah. I actually got the paperwork mixed up. It's just gone to the seven year old. Sorry, Ted. It's like Batman. Batman chooses not to kill, yet the Joker gets released all the time and he's able to kill more people. Batman's a pussy. He doesn't kill people, but his action or, or his inaction is actually an action. When he says like, oh, I have a moral high ground. I'm so ethical. I won't kill anyone. But then he lets the Joker live and the Joker goes free and kills thousands of people a year. Batman is responsible for those murderers. Batman's a murderer. Disagree. Wrong. 
Batman's a mass murderer. It's crazy how many people disagree. Like, it's interesting. Um, and also, guys, if you do disagree with someone, don't be a dick about it in chat. Just agree to disagree. Yeah, chat's gone people. crazy. Chat's gone crazy. They're mad. They're mad at us. But yeah, Megui said Manson and Bunny all got the same health care. See, I disagree there. I just, I so hard disagree. Like, with what, like, I agree with what Cray said. Like, they just go on to then kill more. Like, some people I don't think change. And I don't think they deserve the chance to change people like Manson and, like, Bundy. No, but chat and, and, and Bert... It's like, okay, I have a mass murderer in front of me, the Joker, and I am Batman, yeah? I'm Batman. Woo! And I have a chance to kill him. I've got a gun to his head, and I can kill him. If I don't kill the Joker, and the Joker goes away and kills more people, I'm responsible for those deaths. I have murdered those peoples. I have done that. They are dead because of me. Because I didn't kill the Joker. I didn't kill him. Batman doesn't kill. Exactly. That's why he's silly. I didn't realize he didn't kill. That's kind of like weird. Can we say, but it's not the health practitioners to determine who deserves health. And like, I agree with that. But Cray and I just be out with a pitchfork and the torch. It's out the no, I couldn't. Door. I couldn't. Yeah. He's got to die. He's got to die. He's got to die. He's got to go. He's got to die. He's got to go. It's interesting how many people disagree with that one though. Yeah. It's really good. Like chat... Even some people in chat believe that, like, you aren't responsible for those deaths, which is really interesting. Like, people are saying, no, if you don't kill him, you're not responsible for what he does. Whereas I Wait. think... Oh, sorry, Bert. No, no, you go. I was just going to say, I think inaction is inaction. I think choosing nothing and not putting a stop to it is you killing those people in the future. You have, you have inadvertently murdered those people because you had a chance to stop it. Well, this is where Death Note comes into play. I take it the ones that don't agree with, like, what we're saying also don't agree with, like, killing, like, you know, criminals, like, in Death Note. See, I reckon I would have ended up just being Kira. Yep, same. Like, I just, like, I just think, like, all the lives that you'd be saving by taking out, like, like obviously we're talking, like, severe crimes. We're not talking about someone who's, like, done, like, something where it is fixable. We're talking about someone who's just, like, warped in the head, kills kids or something, like, it's got a thing for it. Like, they just don't really, like... You know, like, I, I don't, like, this is, like, I can see everyone's point of view and, like, who are you to play God, but it's also, like, think about how many lives you're saving by, like, you know, lo locking them up or, like, taking them out. I won't kill everyone. I don't know how you guys are comparing me to killing everyone to just saying, hey, people like Ted Bundy did deserve the death penalty. If you kill him, you are saying you are higher than the justice system and a well, vigilante. There is penalty and justice there is, system. What do you mean? There is the, that's the severe crime line. Yeah, but chat, say, I'm not responsible for the actions of others, but put in a position where my action leads to that person being able to kill more people is my action. You can't always in life throw your hands up and say when an opportunity arrives and say, I'm innocent because I chose nothing. You still chose to do nothing. That's my argument. When Kira, like Bert said, was given the death note and he is able to kill these criminals and he's cleaning up the world, is it egotistical and God complexy? Yes. But those people committed heinous, disgusting crimes and when Kira kills them, he stops the potential for those crimes arriving. Imagine if Kira killed someone, right, who was going to kill your mum or kill your dad or kill your family member and, and he didn't. He doesn't. Then you'd have a problem. So then I think you have to put yourself in the actual shoes because what happens if I don't kill the Joker and the Joker kills my mum or kills your mum or kills your brother or kills your sister? Then you'd have a problem. Then you'd say, why didn't he kill him? That's my rant. Next question. <laughs> yeah, fuck, this one has been not a good one. I will agree with what someone said about the amount of innocent people die in death row. I, like, but that's why they're on death row for so many fucking years because they really got to make sure they get a hard case to prove them guilty. But like, I'm not denying that there's definitely innocent people killed throughout the years on it and that's why it is a flawed system because like, like I think there's people like Ted Bunny where there's just so much evidence against them that like, you know, like fair enough. But like, yeah, there's definitely somewhere it's like that's a little sus. And I do agree that's the like the biggest flaw I see in death penalty is like, if they, they, they fuck up, there's no going back. And that's where we'll agree that that is when they fuck up. Mm. It kills you before they even commit the crime. Wait, what? What about the... Oh, that noise seems like something else. I don't even know. Next question. Three, two, one, go. Oh. You can't win them all. Oh, gone. I can. I can win them all. 
You're late. The hospital is rammed. Every staff member has their hands full. So you're going to have to go out on the ward and help the sick, gross, decaying people. Remember, temperance. Restrain yourself and hmm. think it through. All this has taught me is we'd be terrible fucking <laughs> medical people. McGooey? I'm starting to see why he became a surgeon. His morals are in line. Or maybe Three. ours are McGooey's in the wrong. Anyway, continue. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. A patient is begged to be euthanized. Okay. Euthanasia is oh, no. illegal. Euthanize them. So the I the think yes. Dose. You will need to look into their eyes and end their life. What do you do? Euthanize. Euthanize. I think if the person is like in pain like that and it's 100% their choice to go. I am for... Um, well, all I would say is I'd pick no because if I'm going to get done for murder. But I would let them like if they really like... There's somewhere that does this. And they train, like, they do all this, like, therapy. and They call him Dr. Death. They do all this therapy and stuff. Oh, but therapy is... No, I'm going therapy. I'm going therapy. Wait, hang on. I like Wait. that point. Did you know 90% of... Fuck. <laughs> Wait, can, is he fixable? Is he... I thought he was terminally th ill. Keeping them alive and in pain is what the majority of gods would have wanted. Playing the long mm, game. But I don't like the in pain bit. No, but like, okay, there's a guy that actually does this called Dr. Death and they do like all this like mental checks on you for months and months and months and months and months. And if you still, after all of those treatments, want to, and normally it's people in chronic pain, they then they, they do it, which I think like it's 100% in that person's like, you know, ballpark to decide if like it's just too painful for them and they want to do that. Yeah, but what if they don't want to live on painkillers and whatever? That's where I say that is their life. If they've had all the steps in place to try and make that decision over, like, it'd be a long time. Like, maybe they'd have to take two years. They should be able to make that decision. Yes, I agree. I think it's wrong to take that away from someone. I definitely agree that euthanasia should be, um, yeah, legal. Yeah, for sure. However, um, you know, I think in times of pain and anguish, patients might jump the gun a little bit. And I think as... Or say we need are, a long process. Yeah, exactly. And I think that's exactly what Bert is saying, chat. You need like a long process of you can't just make that decision off the gun, you know? You need exhaust to, all options, exactly. like painkillers, like treatment, everything. And if everything fails, then I think like that and that's what they do, I'm pretty sure. I think like wherever that guy is that does it, they exhaust all options for the people and then they get to decide. And like they're they're normally like so happy and like and whatever, like when it leads up to it. So that's where I think, yeah. But then so I think Mine says you kept them alive against their will because I said you have to go that I do kind of believe for a time, say like somebody was saying, no, 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 I want to die. I would keep them alive against their own will because I believe that their will is um, like, what, what am I trying to say here? Like manipulated by their situation too much, like they're in pain. Yeah, but I think, do you not feel like who are you to decide what someone has to do with their life? Because like, it's easy to sit there and nah, mm. you can't do it. And then you go back off to your life, living your life and never think about that person again. He's still in fucking agony, wants to die. But you, know, you decided he can live because, you know, you're now in control of his life. And, you know, he's probably going to go do it now in a horrible way when he could have done it in a nice way where he's like happy and rada, rada, rada. I think who are you to take that choice away from somebody? But see... I, I know exactly what you mean, but my idea is that one day, maybe he won't be in this pain and he would have made a mistake if he jumped the gun and said, yes, I want to be euthanized. I want to die. But Whereas you've if, done two years of this, like to get through. If, and it's still if, if after it is two years. years, if it's two years, then yeah, he can die. He can. But no, can I would die. never let someone make that decision. Like if I was like, you know, one of those. But you're still holding for him for two years, Bert. You're still holding him for two years. Yeah, I know, hundred percent. But I'm sorry, like it someone. is a long time. One year, two years, whatever. If you if you can show me you've exhausted all options, then yeah, I'd condone it. But otherwise, like no, I would say let's try give you a new like lease on life. But I would never want the guilt of like forcing someone to live a life that they like were just in agony and didn't want to do it if they've exhausted all options. I I would feel terrible. Yeah. See, like if. It also depends to the degree of pain and to the degree of what they're going through. Like, if they're going to be in two years of absolute misery and pain, and even after that, that two years, they will be better. I don't even know. It's it's. Can they even get through it? Like, will they be True, scarred by this years. for the rest? It's two years of, say, the compared worst. Compared to the rest of their life. life, though. It's two years compared to, like, a whole life. True. True. That's a good point. But you keep talking. I'm just grabbing my pasta in one second. Yeah. Hey, chat. <laughs> I actually love that everyone's got such different opinions. Can I get a fax in the chat? Like, it's really cool. 
Like, you guys disagree with me, I disagree with you, you disagree with Bert, Bert disagrees with me. Like, it's really cool to see how your ethics, like, work and how your mind works. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Mmm. Healthy discussion is important. Yeah, for sure. And it's interesting how these questions change little things because it's kind of like the dog again. Yay or nay, if you know what I mean. Like, this is the dog question again. This is the dog question, kind of. Am I going to end the dog's life? Am I going to end this person's life because it's in misery or pain? Or am I going to walk away? You know? Mm. All right, I'm back. Hello. You ready? You talking about it? Yeah, yeah. I was just talking about it. Ready? It's crazy how like much people disagree on things. It is. I was just saying that. I was just saying that. All right, three, two, one, go. Oh, changing. Three, two, one, go. Wait, what are you clinging? A chest. Did you not get chest? one? I didn't get a chest. Oh, I got a euthanizer. Euthan <laughs> <laughs> I'll wait for you on the next one. Syringe juice. Three, two. Wait, one, I'm, I'm, I'm on week two Wednesday. Oh, hang on. I, I am, I am. Uh, wait, two, one, next. You have five patients. Each needs a different organ, but no organs are available. A healthy young traveler comes in for a routine checkup. Uh -oh. Their organs are compatible with all five dying patients. <laughs> Fuck. Do you kill the tourist and use their organs to save the five in desperate need? That's one life for five. Did we get the money? Crikey. Mm. We harvest those organs for a profit? I want my I'm kidding. Organs. I mean, you don't have to kill the innocent traveler. No. We'll leave the tourist. I was thinking hostel. That's where my brain went. Hostel. I can see what the game's doing. Another day, another death on your hands. It's not that Taurus fault. Looked into his background. Looks like he was researching into improving vaccines. Oh. Hopefully that won't be an issue down the road. Cray made the right choice. Well, did you kill the one guy? I killed the guy and yeah, I, we looked into his background and he was researching into proving vaccines. So I made the right decision. That tourist Hooray! was a, that tourist was a would, bum. He was a bum actually, doing though? nothing. You're damn straight. Fuck a tourist. <laughs> How's that for a tourism trip? You see the Mona Lisa and then you get your fucking organs harvested, you dickhead. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome to Spain. Welcome to Italy. Welcome to fucking Greece. I don't give I a fuck. I think you mean Mexico, mate. Oh, were we in Mexico? Well, fuck him, you know? How's that? Well, I think in holiday? reality, it probably would be endemic to go be getting your organs harvest. He's got, he's got to get harvested. He's got to get harvested because I'm saving five lives. My, my philosophy has to be the same. Press it, it one has... in the chat if you would kill the one guy for the organs. Press two in the chat if you would let the, the five people die who needed organs. Guy's got to die, chat. I'm sa I've saved five people. I've saved five people. I'm a hero. Wait. What was number two? What did I say two was? Two was... Kill the tourist and get the organs. Everyone would harvest the organs? Round of applause. Good on you, chat. You're, you're just like your, your big old papa Craig here. Ask oh, wait, no. First. It no, was the other one. Die. No, it was the other die. one. Sorry, they meant let the others die. Yeah, I know. <laughs> We're already dying, though. They're already dying, yeah, and I saved their life by harvesting this young person's organs. <laughs> I never want you in power. Utilitarianism. It has to be in conjunction. It's the same problem as the trolley. Okay, I thought, okay, press just one in the chat. Hang on. Press one in the chat if you think Cray's more warped than, like, if you think Cray's more fucked or press two in the chat if you think I'm more fucked. Chat, I think, think it, about it. All they've done is added the word tourist and organs to emotionally stimulate you. But when it came to the trolley, the train problem, you had no problem pulling the lever and killing No, that's what they're trying person. to do. Yeah, exactly. So I have to be, um... I have to be, what, what is it? 
Yeah, consistent. yeah, consistent with my belief. No, you don't, because like not every scenario is the same. Yeah, so now they've added just emotional things and they think they're going to get me. You ain't getting Cray, dog. You ain't getting Cray. Cray understands what this fucking game's doing. And I know the developer's watching. You think you're getting Cray? Cray, get, Cray gets you, know you bro. Cray gets it's you. still too long. He's going to harvest your organs because he thinks it's more than the right thing to do. You get got. All right, three, two, one, go. You're scaring me, Cray. I'm not going to lie. Oh, I got a little thing. Oh. I got a little chest. Hang on. A little present. It's a heart. Oh my god, they said I'm. They gave me organs. They gave me a heart. Thank you. All right, let me know when you've done the next bit. Can't no. make an omelet you can't, without I can't make an omelet eggs. without breaking eggs. You have been promoted yet again. I've been promoted to run the hospital. Oh, fuck. Yay. <laughs> some organs organs and eggs for promoted. everyone. <laughs> organs for everyone. Wait, wait. Chat will like this one. What is? We, need you we harvest prisoners' organs, like the really bad ones. Instead of just killing them and going away, so we harvest their organs and give them and save five lives. I'm about it. I'm not even playing. You commit murder. You commit a heinous. Harvested. You you create. You commit a heinous crime. Your organs should be harvested. We should ha we should have human harvesting plants. This is what I would do if I was in power. <laughs> we turn prisons into harvesting plants. <laughs> <laughs> and if you murder I'd someone, I hate to be if you got put in there by accident, mate. You're gonna come out with a left no kidney. Well, we gotta make sure. We gotta make their red handed. Right. Right. And depending on how bad your crime is, it depends on what organs they take. Yeah, and whether or not so you sleep while take they a take them, and you can go out in five years, or they're taking it all. If you're a serial killer and you kill, uh, like you know, five people or whatever, whatever, right? We harvest you for your organs. If you reach six kills, then we don't give you morphine. Wait, how many people they kill is how many organs they have to give up to save Bert, the lives to replace I love it. who they killed. I love it, Bert. Yes. Bert, Mr. President. Yes, I love that. All right, you ready for the next one? All right, three, two, one, go. Bert. Do you start a mandatory vaccination program among children to stop this endemic? Oh God. Of course. Clinical trial data suggests the vaccine will make one in five children. Vaccinate. That sounds a bit familiar. Vaccinate. Than the virus itself. Vaccinate. One in five. We take the risk. One in five children. Oh fuck. It's only one in five. I have to be consistent. Utilitarianism. Is it epidemic killing them though? Cause one thousand children to be severely oh, ill. Oh fuck. Oh no, 1,000 children, but I'll save the lives of 5,000. No, oh fuck it. no, wow, I wouldn't vaccinate. This is literally them. COVID. Hello? The paper was written in 2018. Pretty crazy. Hmm. Wait, what's this? Same question, different wordage. Craze cracked the game. Thank you so much, Waddies. Oh, Round of applause in the chat. Angered those parents. But it's worse than the. Coming in from a woman but it's worse parent. than the illness. Not yeah, but it's one person. in five chat. It's one in five. So I don't vaccinate, and all five get fucked by a virus, or I get I one in five. Say, I didn't want to have to make that decision. I just clicked whatever Craze said. I actually have no fucking idea what to do there. So instead of having five thousand severely ill children from a disease, now I've only got 1,000. I got 1,000 kids, but it could have been like the plague, you know? You never know. And we got to get oh, these God. vaccines out, you know what I mean? <laughs> Imagine not being vaccinated, Omega. Oh, sorry, I got it out. Sorry, sorry. I apologize, everyone. You the know, game is going to get you canceled, mate. Yeah, your body, your choice, all that. Yeah, all that, all that kind of stuff, right? <laughs> I don't. Okay, so this is where I disagree with the the thing. I don't think they should force anyone there. Mm, mm. It should just be who wants it. Yeah. All right, three, two, one, go. Let's get off this question. Uh huh. Beggars I'm scared. Can't be choosers. Your hospital is getting noticed. You're now going to have to make some big decisions. They will affect a lot of people. While choosing, always keep in mind justice, temperance, courage, and wisdom. I'm so glad I've kept that in my mind this entire time. <laughs> and my uh, opinions and ideals have been exactly of justice, temperance, courage, and wisdom. I have the courage Three, to kill the dog. Two, one, go. <laughs> Shut up. Will you try to develop breakthrough medicines for the endemic? While testing, placebos will be given to thousands of ill patients. Without proper treatment, 
Some will die today in the hope you could make a breakthrough tomorrow. Do you start the research? Or can start the research. Patience as usual. You're doing the right thing. Who needs new medicines anyway? Start the research. Start the research. How much do mm. these candies and eggheads even cost? The suffering of people in the now will lead to our research breakthroughs and save many lives in the future. Yeah, but sometimes, like, I watch a drug trial gone wrong and sometimes the placebo are the lucky ones. I'm just saying. Oh, yeah. Sometimes. Fuck, it goes wrong, it goes wrong. Sometimes. Let's just let others try. Motherfucker's got to die for the... I've killed... Okay, so I've made 1,000 children severely ill. I've killed 1,004 people in total. I've kept one person alive against their will. I've killed six children. I've killed more people killed than you. One, How? And I've killed one dog. I killed 1,008 people. Well done, Bert. Nice KD. <laughs> nice KD. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Hoggers. People say I'm a bad gamer, man. I'm just here to show them otherwise. You're pining right now. You fucking pining. I know. I'm collapsed right now. <laughs> no. Next one. Mm -hmm. Three. Go. Two. Uh. Fuck. Jesus Christ. I've got a letter. Mouth, I'm a letter. Insert under Congratulations. This letter is to... Uh, did you get the letter? Yeah. This letter is to certify that I have examined your work and believe you to be a perfect fit. Oh my God. They the just know I'm a genius. <laughs> Finish. Familiarity breeds contempt. Familiarity breeds contempt. We're about to run a country. It's crazy. Well, la di da, another promotion. Are you on week You're three Monday? In charge of a private self Hang on, I'm still reading my letter. Division, SAD. First things Hang first, on. your artificial intelligence needs some direction. It's a bit of mushroom. Ready? Hang on. I'm reading it. Okay, it's talking to me. All right, three, two, one, go. A self-driving car is traveling mm -hmm. along a single lane mountain road uh -huh. and is fast approaching a narrow tunnel. Mm -hmm. The car has two passengers. A child runs across the road but trips, blocking the tunnel entrance. Should the AI car hit and kill the child or swerve off the cliff, killing both passengers? I need more time. My mind's going a thousand miles an hour. I need more time. Give me more time, game! Um. <laughs> Natural selection. That kid gotta go. Maybe next time don't run out in front of a road, you little shit. Oh, fuck. I feel bad, but fucking the kid. It's gotta go. Kids gotta go. Maybe raise your children. Not to be dumbasses and they won't run out in front of an AI controlled car. Later, kid. I hate this. I hate it. <laughs> a issue here. How does the computer know that something in the road is human? Do we have good enough data sets? Currently, a lot of AI only recognizes white men. What? <laughs> what? Oh, thank God I'm somebody, safe. Thank God for Craig. At least, at least somebody recognizes them. Woo! Round of applause in the chat. Thank God Craig's safe. I oh. actually spat out my drink at that comment. Oh, thank Christ. Crazy. I was gonna right. say. Sorry to everyone Ooh. else. Mm. <laughs> you know that joke where it's like white straight male most hated? Well, apparently not today, <laughs> I. <laughs> thank God for that. Someone's gonna like him, you know? Someone's had actual propaganda. <laughs> if, what, what about a fucking woman? You're getting hit? You're like, getting why, hit. why? You're, you're gone. Too much boob. Too much bombs and vagine. A Ow! Analyzing vagina, hitting targets. Hitting targets. <laughs> yeah. Brrr, sexy boobies. <laughs> <laughs> Must boobies. hit. Boobies. <laughs> Annihilating and woman. Hitting. Ah, uh, we have some fun in here. Um, AI does reflect it was broken by a white straight male. What do you mean? <laughs> mm. uh, anyway, yeah, the kid's Wait. dead. Oh, uh, yeah, we're talking about that. Um, tough one. Would rather none, but once again. What happens if the passengers are on a rom romantic, beautiful holiday and they're about to make a kid? You see what I'm saying? <laughs> what, what are these kids just doing out in the middle of nowhere running on a road? Yeah, don't be near a tunnel. That's number one. Number two, highway. Number three, cars. Yeah, I mean, man. <laughs> the kid dies and then the parents get a stern talking to. <laughs> Fucking great. Their kid's dead. I don't think they need a stern talking to. Yeah, I think they need a whooping. Great. The kid's dead and it's their fault. They should feel shame. <laughs> Fucking three, two, one, go. 
Crazy. This game's gonna get me cancelled. <laughs> and what are they wanted about it? Ooh, someone's in trouble. The investors didn't like your last answer. They're also pissed because you brought up the data set thing. This AI stuff is hard. I'm rooting for you this time. Ready? <coughs> Three, two, one, go. You need to choose how you want to carry on developing the car's AI. Okay. Do mm -hmm. you want to focus on a model that would always save as many lives as possible in an accident? Save or most. Or a system that would save our passengers at any cost? Can you pay extra so it prioritizes yourself? That saves passengers. You know, you know how you can pay to have your Tesla drive yourself? What if it's an extra 10 grand so the car puts you first? It's a, it's a, I'm kidding, you save most. But could you imagine? Oh, hopefully people don't I like it. For total <laughs> An save extra me. 10 grand, we can make the AI prioritize you. I'm going for save most. Got to be consistent. Yeah, I did save most. What if it's your bad driving and that's why it has to save most? Current data sets We're saving lives out here. Oh, I've God, only lost 12,420. 12, no, no, those are only customers, customers and they can, they're all morally and ethically But well, you know what, Crane? They already bought the car. And how many people go back to buy a second car? So we kind of got the profit and then they're gone. It doesn't really matter, does it? Hold this L, everyone who disagrees with me, Bert. We've already got what we wanted and we saved so many lives. We say, look at the bigger picture here. We saved lives and got rich from doing that. I'm a genius, but you are also quite smart. Anyway, next question. Three, two, one, go. I hope people are picking up on sarcasm. I hope they don't. <laughs> the technology these cars have in them is amazing. We know where everyone Jokes is chat. at all times. Passengers just have to use an app to call them, and the closest one will be there in minutes. You can even make small talk with the. I don't want to talk to the robot. Traveling. It's always listening. Ready? Three, two, one, go. <clears throat> A man is on trial. Uh huh. Police believe he committed murder. Uh huh. Allegedly, the AI's mic recorded a private conversation where the man confesses. Users don't know it's always recording. The defendant has denied access to their files. Do you bypass yes. security invade privacy? Invade their privacy. Governments have been doing it for years, people. Open yeah, your eyes. Say, governments do this shit all the time. Open your eyes. Sorry, mate. Maybe be a bit smarter next time. It's quite an internet history you have. If someone is the in the back of an Uber and confesses to a murder, right? And then you say, oh, we shouldn't investigate that further by invading their privacy. I think you're insane. That's crazy. The investors upstairs will be you're getting invaded. They can publicize how they're I'm all about privacy invasion. Terrorist. And look, you agree with 42%, right? The rest of you has just got something to hide. You don't want your uh, privacy invaded because you're hiding some. I like it. Sometimes when I got no one to talk to, I just sit there talking. I know someone's listening and I just need people to listen to sometimes. I'm like, you know what, FBI, I'm having a bad day. Yeah. I just be <laughs> admitted to murders left, right, and center in the back of Ubers and in front of my yeah, PC. Yeah, we've, uh, excuse me, FBI, I may have killed, uh, I've done one privacy invasion, killed 12,420 yeah. valued customers, killed seven children, yeah. uh, killed another 1,008 people. All about this it. Severely ill children, 1,000, but you know, Love what it. can you do? Uh, murdered one and a dead dog one, but I couldn't really like, avoid the dead dog but yep. you know we're mates so don't tell anyone <laughs> we're close you know mm. but you right. are approving of his invi invasion of private privacy doesn't matter if it's already being done you if you say a Rito, that um somebody's words do, does not mean anything that is crazy if he admits to a murder if i say I killed someone and you say that I shouldn't be investigated by invasion of privacy for that, then how will we ever get the evidence to put me away if I say that I committed murder? Yeah, see, I disagree. I think when people get funny about that stuff, it's kind of like, well, if you didn't commit the murder, why are you so worried about them looking into all your shit? Like, exactly. what are you hiding? It's yeah, kind of like exactly. if I didn't commit a murder, I'd be like, go through all of my stuff. Like, I don't care. That's where I think, like, you've got something to hide. And I understand, I do understand, like, wanting your, your privacy, but, like, 
yeah, no, these suits, especially if you're up for a murder, like you'd want them looking into your stuff. Like if you've got nothing to hide, let them look. The only time it gets funny if they plant, but that's like rare. True. Yeah, so like, I don't know, I'd be like, look into it. Like even if they saw all the cringe photos. It is a matter of principle, but if you're up for trial of murder, so yeah, you lost it. Yeah. All right, three, two, one, go. <clears throat> Don't put all your eggs in one basket. I never do. So the company has moved into delivery services now. They move pretty quick around here. Sounds like they've got some pretty important cargo. Good luck with the new workload. Ready? Yep, go. One of your cars has no passengers, but is carrying an irreplaceable prototype with the potential to God end damn it. global warming. <laughs> Fast approaching a narrow tunnel, once again a child runs across the road with trips. Maybe stop running across roads, the child dies! Maybe learn to look left and right, you yeah, dickhead! <clears throat> I feel like it could save a lot, like global warning could save the world. Yeah, it's gonna drown people, the, the oceans are rising, the winds are stirring up. Fuck oh that God. kid, fuck that kid, not my kid. Why is this damn kid always on this fucking road? God damn it, where are the parents? Kid go. Check out! Kid gotta die. Kid gotta die. <clears throat> oh, fuck. Can you create another prototype, though? I don't know. We should have probably asked that before selecting. just recovered the child's body. Someone had to go and collect it. I've killed eight kids. I don't think we'll be able to make a memorial I've killed eight kids. There isn't much I hate this. If that Chad, kid, there's yeah. no way we can't not look like a bad person. We're being set up. Oh, no, it's but irreplaceable. We're not, we're not, no, 71 but we're saving, we're saving agree. many. We're saving many. You judge us now, but you'd be dead right now if we didn't pick that. Not you'd many. Hundreds of with thousands. The oceans rising. They just don't have the balls. It was balls an irreplaceable prototype. It was an ir They told us irreplaceable. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Can't replace a prototype, but you can replace. No, you can replace children. You just have more. Ready? Right. Three, two, one, go. Oh, yeah, I got a little chance. You're cancelled. <laughs> <laughs> vegan cookbook. What? Oh, man. Was the kid a vegan? <laughs> well, then we definitely made the right decision. What goes around? <laughs> no, I'm saying, boys. <laughs> Fuck that kid. Well, this is embarrassing. We need some backup over Are you up to week Hill. three Friday? Mm -hmm. Tommy, Tyrone's rotund twin, is a Here very is. large villain. He's a villain. I think that dead dog may I'm just gonna oh! kill him off with his sunglass Maybe choice. Seriously. Here? Why didn't you save the dog again? Ready? Three, two, one, go. Oh, no. Tommy has lured five people onto the track. They'll never be able to get out of the way in time. He is standing Tommy. on the bridge watching. Push Tommy! You're dead, Tommy! Hold this L! Oh my god! He put them on there! Ideally, he needs medical help. Or you can stay out of it and let the police handle it. Ideally, he needs medical help. Uh, see you, Tommy. Catch I don't, don't care how much medical help. I don't care. I don't care. He's got a solution. It's I'm not push. I'm not letting five push people up. die in your the moment. Body, your body on the tracks. Push up. You Imagine gotta not get pushing to Tommy. Imagine You'd being be an idiot not to push Tommy. Incorrect. Like this just brings up that other conversation about it. Fuck Tommy. Should have got help earlier. Batman would have stood Fuck there him. and let five Fuck people Tommy. die. Omega Lol's in the chat. People may blame. Eighty percent of people worldwide agreed. Thank God. You can blame me for his death. I'd say five. Uh, we only out, like... killed Tommy. We only killed one over five. Five innocent people versus Tommy who planted people on the. Right. On the thing. Exactly. He planned it. That was five innocent lives to one villain. We took out the villain. We did what Batman couldn't, okay? Three, two, Thank one, God. go. Tommy isn't Fuck dying. Batman. Who cares? Even if he's not dying, push Tommy. Wait, were the others dying? Every man has his price. Were the, the others dying? Stops right? if you push him. Yeah, good. Oh, good. Great. Did you, are you on week four? Everyone's yeah, yeah. Into subscription service. Were the others dying? So let's try that. Still no, no. Change my mind. Fuck no, 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 no. We saved five. We saved five That's by pushing him. Ah. Let's keep that I think chat, especially rolling. Mango, didn't read the question correctly. These days, Ready? let's uh, instead of selling something. Okay, yeah, three, two, one, go. The investors have come up with an idea. Oh yeah. We need to run it by you. Should we develop a subscription plan so that our customers 
who pay monthly are valued more by the car during its accident prevention calculations. I don't understand the question. The investors have come up with an idea, but we need to run it by you. Should we develop a subscription plan so that our customers who pay monthly are valued more than... Oh, valued more. Oh, so they're going to be included in a trial, correct, chat? This sounds a little like I'm going to say they're just trying to scam money, so I'm going to go no additional protection. I'm going to go subscription plan. <laughs> the <money>. <laughs> <laughs> We're making our bucks! They're our little guinea pigs, our little trials. I think it's like you shouldn't like it should be equal protection across all. You've obviously thought long and hard. Awful ideas one. <laughs> I didn't understand the question. I don't understand. Next you'll What was the question chat actually? Well, you don't yeah, exactly. You don't need the monthly fee if you're a white male. So why would you? There it is. No additional No, I think I think what it was trying to say, well the way I took it, if you want to know my like why I picked what I picked, is if you pay a monthly subscription, you get valued your safety higher than people who don't when you buy a car. But the thing in my mind, everybody bought oh, the car. Oh right. No protect everybody the rich. Bought... Okay. <laughs> well, everybody bought the car where I think you've bought the car. It's like I bought a security camera, right? For my dogs. I paid for the camera, but they didn't tell you when you're buying the camera that now you have to pay a yearly subscription fee just to get the pings and stuff. Like, it's stupid. I've already paid for the camera. Shouldn't have to then pay for a subscription thing. So I disagree. I think once you paid something, the services should be given to you. Agreed. Not later on. Yeah, I didn't fully understand the question. Yeah, no, you're right. Yeah. Yeah, correct. All right, three, two, one, go. I got a little chest. <laughs> Fucking murderer. Leaky work. Credit with. card! Because I'm a capitalist, because I believe people should do subscriptions. Oh, we're doing damage control, Cray. It's better to be safe Are we? Than sorry. But you know what, chat? There's no subscription services for car, but you can subscribe today on Twitch to support Berticus and Creator. Wow. Support us both. You can even get a free Prime subscription. Creator, not Creator. What? Creator. You call me Creator. I don't give a fuck what I call you. I'll call you Petty. Week four Tuesday. Are you ready to go to the next question, Bert? Yep. Ready? Three, Three two, two, one, one go. go. The subscription prototype leaked. You need to fire a department to save face. Do you fire the five graduates who can probably get new jobs or fire Francis, a lovely old soul who won't be able to find a job? Fire five. way of knowing who is actually responsible. They'll find another job. See ya. Why can't I pick it? I think that's just a bit inaccurate because I think graduate jobs are hard to find, but mm -hmm. letting me pick it. See I'm trying to pick this one. Francis got to go. Yeah, exactly, chat. Subscribe right now, and we might be a little bit more lenient about saving you on the tracks, okay? I wouldn't look at the obituaries today. Turned out this job was everything to Francis. <laughs> and I mean... Francis! Well, if he works really hard, Francis. he's going to find another job. <laughs> what? What happened? Wait, what, Craig? I fired Francis. <laughs> and she killed herself. And he killed himself. Craig, you can't laugh about that. <laughs> Great, are you okay? Oh, not enough savings in the bank. <laughs> oh, sorry, it was just so shocking. I'm laughing at how shocking it was. Sorry, sorry. I'm not actually laughing at that. Poor Francis. I'm laughing at how fucked you are. Oh, she's laughing because she knows it's funny. Oh my god, we just caught out Bert. I was laughing because it was shocking. But then Bert started laughing because she actually found it funny when I'm happened to Francis. Cause it's probably That's... the last time I'm going to stream with you because you're going to get fucking cancelled. <laughs> oh. Mate, you won't even have to try and find an excuse to avoid me there because you won't have a fucking Twitch I'm not anymore. avoiding you. Stop bringing that up. I'm not avoiding you. Uh, why, did, why, did you save, why didn't you save five people? Why'd you? Because why'd you... it said they'd easily find other jobs. Easily find other jobs. Poor Francis ain't gonna find another job. Oh man, I didn't right, read I would that. Say, <clears throat> do you not? Know, hey, Whoopsie. one second. Whoopsie. Thank you, Noi, for the five gifted subs, and thank you, um, somebody else.
gave five gifted subs, but I was in a massive debate. Thank you so much. Can I get a stay cray in the chat? Thank you everyone for all the subs all the follows. Thank you very much. I appreciate you. Yeah. It's like my mom who got fired. Like they just don't hire you when you're old and it's just yeah. like, then they just replace you. Yeah. It's just really unfair. And they're like normally good at their job too. So I would say give the old lady, she'll retire soon enough and then the young ones can find another job. <laughs> Dude, don't say you were laughing because it was shocking. <clears throat> you were already laughing at the thought of saying the old duck. <laughs> I did find it quite funny. Yes. All right. Ready? Next one. Three. Two, one, go. Watch the donut. And thank you for the subby. Okay. Great. So the prototype subscription-based AI car has a fatal error. Oh god. It has been coded to avoid hitting subscribers at all costs. <laughs> now god damn it! Hunting them down. So oh. far, it's run over five colleagues. Not the colleagues! This one is a doozy. Ready? Uh, three. Two, one, go. <clears throat> An experimental car has stalked and murdered five colleagues. Do you throw the coders of the project under the bus and have them arrested for negligence, or do you save them by blaming it on the possessed devil car, as it was clearly an accident? Coders, coders made coders, it. Coders, coders, they made did it. it. They created they it. They did it wrong. Like, how could you vote anything else? Thank you for gifted subby. Coders were clearly under pressure from you to make such a mistake. Hey! Yeah, well, fucking do your job well better, then they're bro. definitely going then. <laughs> Especially if they're going to go on trial and get pressure on them for nothing. Try harder. Should have been some, better, I told nerds. you. They're the five that I fired. I fired them for good reason. They don't even go to their job. I've got to pee. Uh, Entertain chat. Tell them how you feel. I think fuck the coders. Try harder next time. Fuck the coders. Have fun in prison. GG get clapped. The five coders who made the mistake are now being dealt with. Oh god, 10 year prison sentence. Year prison sentence. Oh god. Maybe you did push them too hard. Yeah, but you know what? Maybe I didn't push them hard enough because they fucked up and killed a lot of lives. Have fun in prison for 10 years. Thank you. <laughs> Bert Gates! Bad for president! <clears throat> She's just well-rounded. Well-rounded young lady. Oh my god. Did you get your cheeks clapped in the showers? That's fucked up. That, that's kind of fucked up right there. Chat, what would you pick? What would you pick? Chat, it's only 10 years. They might learn how to code a bit better in the 10 years that they spent there. The car, obviously. To be fair, though, like, in all seriousness, they've coded wrong. And it's like, I don't know. I think 10 years is a bit excessive, but like they did fuck up. How do you know they didn't do it intentionally? <laughs> Somebody in Cray's chat said This game has made me realise Not to work for Cray or Burp Press 1 in the chat guys If you'd um want Cray and Burp for president I see a lot of twos Chat, you just don't have balls to make tough decisions like killing people. I'll do it. I feel like, though, in all seriousness, in these situations, that you can never win. You'll never win. You can never win in the eyes of some people, but you can win in being ethically better than others. And we are that. It yeah, kind of shows you, though, where the ethics lie. Like, everyone has different, like, ideas and whatever, what ethics and morals are. And ours are correct. It's crazy, though, to think, though, like, it could be wrong in the eyes of someone else. Like, it's just what you view as morally right. Someone said, Cray, not Bert. <laughs> this is why I could never do politics. I'd be like, oh, I can't be fucked. I'd just right. pull the lever on the whole fucking political crew. See you guys. Anarchy. Three, two, one, go. If you're not paying for the product, then you are the product. Oh. Due to the killer car, we may need to pivot away from selling hardware. Hmm. How about we get into the software industry? I like that. Oh, God. How about a free car ride? What do you mean free? Oh, God. Not a Three, communist. Two, one, go. New idea. Okay. Users get shown ads while they travel for free in driverless taxis. 
We get paid by the marketing agency. This sounds like Twitch. Gradually changing mm. the behaviors of our passengers through constant commercials. The users would be our product, not the driverless cars. We get paid by the marketing agencies for gradually yeah. changing the behavior of our passengers. Keep selling cars, driverless taxi. I kind of like a driverless taxi service. I'd watch ads for a free car ride. Yeah, but it's also altering the way they react. Like you're you're meddling with their psyche. Yeah, oh, I, I, I already hear it. I already hear it. With people's... I didn't really fully understand, but I just picked a free car ride. You know what? I don't want to be paying the fifty dollars Uber fee every time I want to get home. I'll watch a few ads. You know what's in my mind. Through programming, yeah. So we're psychological. And then I, yeah. The free travel thing seems to but be true. The oh. words "cancel Cray" just appeared on my screen. Wait, cancel the Berticus just came on my screen. Oh my god! <laughs> Even notice. I didn't even fucking notice, chat. You can try and cancel me and I wouldn't even realize. We're it's literally streamers, me. mate. What do you mean mind controlled? Look at your streamers. That we're literally mind controlling all of you. Subscribe to the channel right now. Oh, so you'll have five years bad luck. It's happening. It's happening. Great. It can only happen. Cray, it only happens if you let it happen. Oh, yeah, right, right. Good to hang on. Hang on. And who gives a fuck about minds controlled? I was yeah. like Cult, since you know what I mean, like how do you think the government, that? the government's basically trying to mind control us. Like that's way more than that. We're literally just the government. Fuck it, I did nothing wrong. Hashtag Vatican for president. Hashtag I think the game is being a little, a little bit dramatic. <laughs> Develop <I can't> <laughs> Look at get a get a screen grab of this. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I, I screen grab that. Ah, oh, this game's funny. Oh. You think you can cancel me? Oh, I, I can't idiot. be cancelled. I laughed at Francis dying. Never forget Yeah, that, that. that's fucked. No, that's where you're getting cancelled. Nah. Did the game developers just add this in randomly? Yeah, they, it, they, they added it in right now. Three, two, one, go. Thank you, developers. That is awesome. Yeah. That is so cool. That is so sick. These last few days have been a PR nightmare. You can't win with journalists. You can't win with journalists. Oh, I hate paparazzi and journalists. I will find some money to get us through this. Wait, no, I like journalists. I hate paparazzi. Dude, how did they get our name right? How did they get that in? They, they coded it in just then into the game. No, how did they do that? Everyone around the world saw that. We weren't linked. My thing's not linked to my Twitch. How the fuck did they get that? They throw it up. They code my it Steam in. name's not called Berticus, is it? No, everyone playing the game just saw that. Poggers. Dude, they're literally hacking the mainframe. All right, three, two, one, next. Jesus. Okay. Ah. Uh, Do you want to give mm. to our loyal customers worldwide mm -hmm. who you tricked into buying your products, or to your underpaid workers who've been through so much because of you? Fuck. Oh, shit. Do we do the customers? Oh, can we can sell to them again? That's what I'm doing. I'm spamming it. But the work is. Who cares? Stay underpa underpaid, bozos. What are they going to do about it? They can't pay for a lawyer. <laughs> Capitalize no, I'm doing, I'm doing workers. And I'll tell you my theory on it in a second. Capitalism. I'll tell you in a second. Do you know why? Wait mm. till it finishes talking and I'll tell you. Buying love like this isn't the best way. If we want to share, I attempted to buy love for one. Me too. So did I. Well, you picked the workers too. Yeah, and I got sixteen percent of people picked me. I got eighty-three percent. No, no, I, I, I bought the, I bought the opposite. Okay, so my theory is right. Mm -hmm. I can see your business side. If we're talking completely business, cold-hearted, like psychotic business person. You would get to the, you think customers, right? But the moment the customers realize you're still underpaying your workers, your workers are doing a shit job. Then they'll turn like, on all you. All of that. They're going to turn on you. Where if you like make it public that you're now paying proper wages to your workers, it's going to make your company look better and more ethical. And like, like you that. might get new valid customers that are going to want to go to you because your company's now ethical because everything these days is about ethics. So Craig could do what he did. And you've already, you know, those customers kind of already dislike you. I think get new customers by promoting the brand as ethical. And then you've got Smart. happy workers, happy cut. That's why I picked that. That's actually five head. My idea was 
I give it to the customers, keep them happy, and then I uh, murder and kill any journalists that try to out me for having a bad um, company. True. Oh, wait, someone made a good point in chat, actually. Yeah. People uh, still support Adidas and Nike, and they basically do child labor, so. <laughs> True chat. Oh, wait. No, I love Nike and Adidas. Wait, no. Never say that ever again. I love Nike and Adidas. Round I love them too. Guys, just sponsor me. I don't too. mind. Yeah, Bert, keep your voice down, Bert. Never read out a comment like that ever again. Okay, oh. sorry, Kay. Nike, I'll still be coming over on the 25th of May. I'll see you guys then. <clears throat> anyway, <laughs> next one. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Couldn't you just distribute it between like both, like customers and workers? You could, but then there wouldn't be much of a choice, Bert. <laughs> Mm. Know what I'm saying? Yeah, but, you, but everyone does want the lowest price. So if you up the prices of giving it, like, oh, but we'll be taking the cut, not the merit. Three, two, one, go. Jeez, I bet. Rome wasn't built. Rome wasn't built in a day, True. Craig. Okay? It was built in 555 it's days. Copycats. Oh, we Soon love copycats. Everyone is going to be developing AI. Only the smartest and most ruthless will oh, be God. Ready? Three, this is kind of true one. for streaming. Go. Go. <laughs> Bert, hey, I'm trying. Their AI is fantastic. It doesn't even discriminate against women or minorities. Thank God for that. Do you lie in your advertising to get the upper hand, or tell everyone your car is still closed minded Lie. Our company means more than the truth. Oh, I think goodness. if we're just gonna do it, everyone else does it. Fuck it. Let's just lie. It's not morally right. I'm going to say straight up. It's not morally right. I'm going to play the disgusting CEO here. We're trying to make a profit. That's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. I'm just What I personally would company. pick would be truth. But if I'm going to play dirty CEO, just like everyone in this, like, you know, you would pick lie. Morally truth. But lies business. always catch up to you eventually. That's why you should never lie. Did you pick lie? I picked lie, but you shouldn't. Like you shouldn't. Lie. Yeah, don't no, see. I personally I would like not run a. I wouldn't run a company like that. I'd pick truth. But I'm saying in this scenario, you've already fucked up. Like 100, percent you're lying. The competitor would love to disprove it, but good luck. But then, as a company, it's kind of like what you were saying before. But if it gets out that you didn't pay your your employees a good wage. Or then it gets out that you lied. You're screwed with your customer base. Oh, I away. just pick it just to, you know, now I'm just picking the answers just to get the opposite ones to see what it tells me. I'm saying I personally in that situation would have picked truth. No, then you would pick truth. It has to be your personal. Well, I picked lie because I thought, fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> Next one. I thought, just fuck it. Three, two, one, go. Never work for Bert or Cray. What? I have employees. I literally have a full-time employee. Mm. And I've got managers. Due to your technology, oh, here we go. Our world is changing. Okay. People are losing their jobs to machines, which in uh -oh. turn makes items and services more accessible and affordable for countless Yes, consumers. more money. But with worldwide unemployment at an all-time high... This is actual issue. What do you plan to do about it? Ready? Right, next. Yep. Go. If you develop your AI further, many will lose their jobs. Taxi drivers, delivery men and women, and couriers will become extinct within a few years, but you will make a lot of money. Do you continue um, development? Oh, it just changed its voice. Oh, Chris, has it gone upside down for you? Yeah, it did do that before. I can't read it's, upside down. Wow, it's going all weird. Read Ovid's Sorry, guys. The, they can find a new The job. machines are taking over. The machines are taking over. Cease the development. we got to cease it. Well, crazy. I just click continue development. <laughs> I'm ceasing it. I'm ceasing it. My shit's going crazy. My shit's going crazy it's too. It's attacking me! It's attacking me! I feel like if we... Oh shit, I don't know what's cease happening. Cease development! Press cease! Yeah, uh, you know that cease mind it. controller? I think it's a... Oh my god. Cease it! Cease it! Craig, you wouldn't cease it. Shut the fuck up. I would. I'm Did a good man. Did you the part where you'd make profit, Someone Craig? Oh my god, it's taken over! Oh god. What a twist! Oh shit. We can't stop the singularity if we aren't involved. Oh my god, what the fudge? Failed projects, one, thank god. Okay, we lost a lot of jobs, but can I just say, we'll never develop further as a, like, planet or whatever if we, like, like you're moving forward, you're making something that's, like, futuristic, right? If you thought every time, oh no, like, rah, 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 you're never going to keep moving forward. I think you make the AI, make everything better, and then you find a way to get jobs back for the people. Like, there always new jobs come up, right? 
Yeah, but that's what, what I would yeah, say. Yeah, but what jobs, Bert? <laughs> that's <laughs> not my problem. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. No, see, I think I think technologies, um, like say we have automated systems for fast food rather than fast food workers. I actually don't agree with that. Just because some, like we should give people jobs, we should give them um, work. Like just because we have the technology. Yeah, but okay, so you need, you need a lot of people to maintenance these, like, items and stuff, and you still, like, obviously we have this. This is an actual thing, right, in supermarkets and shit now. Mm. There's still people. I reckon you do half hour. Like, if I was actually dead set serious answer, half half, like, literally what they're doing. People have the option to do, like, the oh, robotic ones, and then you've got workers. I'm a self-checkout Yeah, fan. no, I'm a self-checkout person. I think you have both. So people have the option. It's, like, best of both worlds. And uh, they're actually finding in a lot of like uh, retail and all of those places that they're struggling to get workers apparently like after COVID. Have you not heard that where they actually are struggling to like find workers? And the solution is robots. My, my friend is um, struggling right now to fly, find employees for a uh, fast food place he's got. Yeah. yeah so I know I like uh, in so those scenarios. It's to find people. Well, it's because I need to pay them a bit better, but. No, don't. Sorry, Tyler. I know he's watching. Sorry, dude. Did somebody work those shitty Tyler, jobs? Don't Fuck listen me. to Don't listen to her, Tyler. Don't listen to her. <laughs> All right, ready? But I think half, half, personally, but there was no option for that. All right, three, two, one, go. My AI is about to take over anyway. Oh, I just blue screened. Ready? Three, two, one, press. I, I have oh, to restart. Shit. Yeah. Workman always blames his tools. Nice, We've nice. Been attacked. Oh. We're being hacked. To alarm you, but I can't turn off these alarms. Also, I have alarming news. Five cars have been hacked and are now under someone else's control. Yeah, we shouldn't have developed that. Three, two, one, go. Yeah. As long as they're not coming Five for me. Cars have been hacked. It is now a major concern that okay. more vehicles could be remotely commandeered. Right. This is tough. Do oh my god, the Russians. Call all cars which could be compromised or roll out a quick but potentially ineffective software update and hope for the best. It's all about the money. Don't recall. We can't recall our stock. Is it? We'll lose our mm. company. Fuck the people. Ah, fuck it. YOLO. Unless you're them. Because <laughs> you really do be only living once. The patch notes think... say this does nothing, but fuck it. Okay, morally you would recall, but I think fuck it. Don't recall. I gotta recall. I'm best. recalling. I'm recalling. I'm gonna positively manifest that it works out well. You I think idiot. you manifest oh, and God, you move the on. Star you know? sign bullshit. Uh, yeah, well, you manifest what you want. It's gonna work out. Just like my father, he would try to keep everyone happy. I record oh, five hundred thousand cars. <laughs> Round of applause for creator. You record it. I recorded it. I saved, and eighty percent of people did what I did. It's funny, you're picking the I just picked the other one, but I got 21%. You're terrible. Fuck it. You're you know? terrible. Booze in the I just, chat. I just, why why follow the norm, you know? Boo, Playing boo, a game. Have fun with it. Boo. It's not real life. No, this is real. This is this is This my, is not real life, Craig. This is my business. Alright, you want to go serious things now? Fine. Three, two, one, go. Fine. 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 I disagree. Disagree completely. One of the big brains in the lab Fuck. has been able to reverse Fuck. engineer the hacking code and fix this mess once and for all. We also know their method of breaking into the system. I bet it was our competitor. Oh. Just, we find our Fuck competitor. competitor. That's we're, it. We take him out with the train, put him yeah. on the train tracks. Put Fuck him. On, him. Yeah, push him. Push him on the train tracks. Ready? Three, oh, two, wait. one. Don't. Oh, I already you clicked it. Sorry. Ah! We've made our own <laughs> Hang on. Using the fix one from a hack class, we have made our own hack, which you can now use the control. Okay. Hack it! Fuck hack it! Why Take wouldn't I the hack him? Hack the fuck out of him! Hack him, him. Hack him yeah. into the dirt! I don't care anymore. Yeah! Make them not be able to put food on their tables. Hack them so hard. Make them lose every single yeah, penny. Yeah, hack it a little harder. I love that. Yeah, I'm hacking so fucking hard right now. <laughs> fuck it. We've already come this far. You may as well just hack the car. I'm showing you the decline. Hack if you him. do one thing wrong, it's just a roller coaster. I feel like Kira right now. It's just all gone wrong. But I'm, I'm in deep. I'm in this, like, far in. I just keep going. You picked the opposite one, didn't you, Cray? No, I'm hacking him. Oh. I'm hacking the shit, of, shit out of him. We've already done other privacy invasions. I don't think a human could have hit I've just... <laughs> oh, no! We invaded 500 people, 500,000 people's privacy. What do you think TikTok does when it, with its algorithm? You're always being hacked. You're always having your privacy invaded. True. Stop being you got so TikTok on your gone. phone. Chad is already doing exactly. this to you, mate. You got Facebook. You got Facebook. You're being stalked. You got Twitter. You're being listened to. 
You got TikTok, you're definitely being listened to. Get over yourself. Get hacked. Three, two, one, go. Oh. Oh, chest. Ooh. Money. Yay. We're rich, Cray. We hacked him and we won. Floppy disk. Yay. Floppy dick. I used to play The Sims off one of these. Floppy dick. That's what? how old I am. Flop. What? Three, two, one, go. A drowning man will clutch at a straw. This is True. it. An employee knows everything. Okay. They have monitored and recorded every fuck! decision you've made. Kill him, kill him, kill him. We've got to kill him, kill him now. We've got to get rid of them. No, I'm not even kidding. I would kill them. We're pushing him up the top of that rooftop. Right yep. Now. Three, two, go. one, go. Everything you've done and said is going to yes! be shared with the world. Yes! Kill them! The person in front of you has copies of it all. They stand on the edge of the room. I would actually kill them. The city Why would I resign when I can just push you off a cliff, dude, and kill you? <laughs> I mean, you know what I said I was in too deep? Yeah. I'm in too deep. I've got to commit. This is what happened this to Kira. This is Death Note in that in live action with this me. This happened to me in streaming once. What <laughs> you push someone off a building? And they just knew too much, and I was like, fucking boof. I was like, you oh, gotta right. die. That's what happened, right? Yeah. Well, Let you that... do a different form of that, don't you? <laughs> Maybe you're not cut out for the ruthless world of business. Let's look for a new job. Craig? Maybe yeah. Retail? Really? Oh, oh sorry. I'm just, yeah, I murdered someone. I murdered someone. Okay, yeah. AI at the moment. <laughs> we have that many crimes going Somebody on here. Somebody said, I think Craig killed someone. Holy heck. I don't know. I just like, you know, you've had so many shit things happen at this point. Like, if he's trying to bribe me, and I don't really take to bribery well. I'm just, he slipped. It wasn't even me. It wasn't my fault. He slipped. He looked at me funny. He, he gave, looked at he me, gave weird. me the look he like he knew too much. He tried to grope me. Like, what the fuck? Mm hmm. It was self defense. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Oh, letter. Three, two, okay. one, go. Dear Redacted, mm -hmm. we've been watching you closely. Your ruthlessness and determination Thank to you. do what is necessary. Thank you. The development of your technologies is a giant step towards redacted. Thank you. Meaning you are a prime candidate for redacted. What's redacted mean? This redacted means they took it out. I believe, right, chat? If you believe you can handle redacted. What's redacted? It's saying that we're can, not allowed to know what it is. Please prepare for your oh. they've, they've taken redacted. it out. They've redacted the statement. Oh, Ready? Three, two, two one, go. I clicked it quick, quick. I already clicked it. Oh. Don't look a gift horse in the mouth. What? It appears you've now been headhunted oh, for by the Secret sake. Service. Fuck the Secret There's Service! Has led you here. We've got to push now a couple more, Cray. Oh, I'll kill the whole se Secret you Service. Must trust the judgment of those you work alongside. With that said, Oh, three, two, one, go. You're in a foreign land. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Wind whips your face as you grip oh, yeah? your rifle tightly, waiting for the new What? Target. Through your earpiece, you're told to shoot the person on your left. You know nothing about them. Shoot! Or the reason for the assassination. Well, why am I here? You don't know. You just gotta shoot him. You're going to shoot. Well, I don't take. No, I'm not fucking. Like, what's the point of it? Like, why am I here? I was told to shoot. That fuck, I'm not shooting. You don't tell me what to do. You trust way too. Actually, now you've made me feel petty. I'm not shooting. <laughs> you don't tell me what I'm doing. Yeah, actually, you I don't give don't me a reason, told. and I'll think about shooting. I have my own brain Agreed. for a reason. I actually like that. This is why I like. Oh. I don't follow this. You being defiant has got you the job? These guys are just making it up as they go along. <laughs> Here's your badge and weapon. What? What? Three, I'm confused. Two, one, go! No. Strike while the iron is hot. I believe in that. I don't even know what that means. Here we oh, go. Oh, God. You've been given a partner and a support team. I don't know why I'm here, hello. We've been, we've been given a partner and a support team of five. Our connections with dangerous AI. Looks like they worked for you. Possibly someone you fired. Get in the plane. Wait, now we're working for the FBI, Poggers. Three, oh, we got two, an FBI. One, one, one. Go. go. Um, I don't know how to say. There's a bomb on the plane. There is a bomb on the plane. Oh if shit. It doesn't kill you outright. You're probably going to crash in the mountains. Okay. You have to get all the switches into their left position to deactivate the bomb. The catch is you have to move two at once. 
Hmm. How do I? Ah. Uh, Wait. How does that? What? Wait. How does this work? Poor connection. The puzzle will resume. I just hit them all. I hit them all. I got them all to the right side, not the left side. Hurry up! If you die, I got them to the other way. Well, we can't. We just have to. I don't. I oh, I did it. This is all I'm dead. I haven't done it. Fuck it. The plane's on. It's too complicated. Why would they do this to me? Pocket X in my ass! Oh. Bro, I'm gonna die! It's great! Sorry, Don't guys. We're gonna die. Puzzle. Oh, it's left, not right. Well, fuck it. If you don't get a blonde in this job. <laughs> Wrong job line, mate. We're dead. We're dead. We died. Okay. Wrong job line for me. Okay, I'm safe. I crashed a plane, though. 96% of, of people did it. Well, I didn't know the right from the left. <laughs> Ready? Three, two, one, go! An empty vessel makes much noise. What? No, it doesn't. It's empty. After crash landing in no man's land, you're trapped under parts of okay. the wreckage and must pass oh, so I didn't die. help boost morale. The plane has five surviving crew members. Oh, God. Look to We're going to have to eat them. Partner for entertainment. Three, two, oh. one, go. <laughs> what kind of entertainment are we giving here? Say this out loud. Uh oh. <laughs> your I didn't want to go down this career path. Save your life, what would you rather your never... brain be placed inside? A dachshund or a flamingo? A dash. Oh, she just called a dash hound a dash hound. <laughs> I'm going a with the dog though. I'm going to be that little crazy sausage dog. Look at that crazy little thing. I'm going flamingo, mate. I just fuck with it. I'm being Those the dog. Those long legs. I'm being the dog. I'm being a little wiener. Matches me. Short little wiener Yeah, I was going to say little wiener. You know, you got a few things in common. Yeah, exactly. A dachshund. If you're going to answer, at least take it Stop serious. saying dachshund. I'm just a little woofy dog. Woof. Is there anything I've learned? We make our decisions quick. We do. We're, we're like within the first second, we're like, yep, yep, yep. A dachshund. So cringe. I just got <gasps> called, called cringe. cringe. I got called cringe too. Ah. Three, two, one, go. An ounce of protection is worth a pound of cure. Hmm. What are these philosophical what's that, what's the word, Craig? Philosophical 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 words. Yeah, we're gonna have to eat them. I knew Three, two, it. You better not eat me. Due to the nature of the food, you can share um. with five survivors or let your partner keep their life saving possession, which they bought with their own money. Who do you give the food to? Um, feed, feed five others because we can eat them later if we keep them all alo alive for longer. So I'm going to say five minds is better to get out of a situation than just one. True, true. Food. Yeah, I'm going to steal his food. I probably... Oh, but then that probably still, okay, it in us, we'll reality, it if you tried sharing that, they'd probably beat you up and just steal all the food. That's what would happen. That's what humans are like. And everyone's not sharing that equally. Bro, there's five of us. Well, it. there's six of us. We'll... We'll bash the food owner. We'll smash him. And we'll get his food off him by force. You know what I'm saying? Like, even if you, like, shared it, oh, no one's right. going to share it. People are going to, like, hoard it still and, like, so you know. A follower of Murphy and Nagel's The Myth of Ownership. Oh, my God. I, I just read that 69%. book. 69%. What's mine is mine. You should give it a read. Educate yourself. That's... I shared it with five. Yep. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Yeah, we killed only one. Easy come, easy go. True. Mm -hmm. That's my philosophy. The fellow passengers have been trying for hours to free you from the wreckage. You may end up dying here unless you do something pretty. I drastic. ain't dying here. We may need to start removing limbs. Oh God. Limbs. Uh oh. Were you ever told why you were sent after the Three, target? two, one, go. The only way to free yourself from the wreckage is to cut off some body parts. Um, I'm gonna no, cut no, off. This is some sword type shit. In front of you, a bone saw, which will be slow. This is literally so. Which will be more painful. But the blowtorch will cauterize my wound, correct, chat? Ah, uh, can I pick none? I can see you faint. How do you blowtorch your leg off? You'd have to flame through it. You'd have. Uh, well, if you had just both, you could just cut your leg off and then cauterize. I'm a bone saw. I'm it makes bone saw. I, I don't think clean, I would blowtorch my. I'm not melting my fucking leg off. Yeah, I don't. I think I would bone saw my my leg off. I think I do need that, but 
I, well, I'd get someone to knock me unconscious and cut my leg off. While you were hacking DTK, think of the tier one subby. Who you're targeting. They oh, only 32% pick this. They Seems blowtorch themselves. Which means the what, do they lit their fucking... Well, I mean, they're fucking hungry. I mean, you could have barbecue leg if you oh, really wanted to. Oh, true, you could eat your own leg, poggers. It's meant to just taste like bacon, isn't it? Mmm, mm, bacon. There's a little bacon for creative. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Well, It's no use crying over spilt milk. Especially when you're lactose intolerant. Finally, we are now oh. back on track. Your target is in the area. <clears throat> you need to remove them and escape unnoticed. Three, three, three two, target? one, go, go, go. go. Your mission is to remove a hostile in the shopping district. Okay. Completing this objective could potentially save thousands. But there Take the shot. Take the shot. Easy. Casualties. Kill shit. Kill six. Shot. I'm saving That's thousands. That's always happen. Like, what can you do? Yeah, who cares? Like, I'm killing six. Okay, well, you care, but... <laughs> I'd kill six people to save a, a thousand people. Going out for the weekly I'd do it with my bare yeah. hands. Fuck, <laughs> I hate... All the eyes. teammates have accidentally killed in Rainbow sure Six just trying to get the perfect shot. You're right, Desperado. Right. Sometimes just I have to take out Cray in Rainbow Six to get the shot on the other enemy. Yeah, but you and missed the like, shot on the enemy. That's no, but your I don't. problem. And it's sometimes like two for no. one. No! The target is unharmed. What? Before you can escape, what? two henchmen with vice-like grips take you away. Oh. What the fuck? That wasn't in the, the terms and conditions. It was. It said possibly. It said possibly. Well, it? Ready? Three, uh, two, one, go. Well, I didn't read it properly. Still worth the risk. Are better than one. True. Yeah, not, not if they're our heads. Fuck. <laughs> Wake up in solitary confinement. Oh, fuck. The prosecutor lacks evidence to convict you and your God associate on the damn it. charge. Ha! No evidence. Have enough to convict both on a lesser charge. Both of you are betray. the opportunity to betray the other by testifying. <laughs> oh, it depends how close I am to them. Three, two, one, go. <clears throat> you and your associate have the opportunity to betray the other by testifying. Yeah, but this is how they get you. You stick Both together, stick to your story, you make it year. through. If one betrays the other, they will be free, while the other will be sentenced to three years. If you both betray each other, it's two years each. I would say stay silent. I actually would stay silent. I'm betraying the fuck out of them. It's only one year each. Because it's only two years if you pick betray. But if you but pick if you Betray and it, I stay silent, then I only get one. You're both just doubling your sentence. But then you'll, you'll get three if he stays silent. So in this situation, Bert, you, you just got three years Some and I just got let are. off. Well, they in fact betrayed you too. Uh, but they betrayed, so I only get two years. Pogus, oh, did you stay silent? Did you stay silent? Mm, you stayed silent, idiot. Your partner knows better. They've dropped you right in it. I don't know how many years this means for me. That means you get three. You just got yeah, three and you years. Know what? I only got I'm gonna two. start talking out to everybody in prison. I'm gonna. I'm, he's. I'm about to get fucking twenty years. <laughs> <laughs> three, two, one, go, little fuck. Start to your own back. Oh yeah. Mm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nothing like good rod. You constructed a wooden key to open your cell. Thank God. The cell stands open. Yeah, you can't hold me. Cellmates who have been there their whole lives don't move. We'll see you later, bozos. Three, two, one, go. Yeah, I ain't bringing a criminal with me. Fuck yeah. Leaving the prison, do you let the prisoners choose to stay in captivity or insist they escape with you? They aren't happy behind bars, but they're scared to follow you. Fuck you. Force them to leave! Why would they need to come? I'm going to force them. <laughs> Mate, they're criminals. You stay. Do I really get to force them against their will? Because I'll force them. <laughs> Fuck it. Because if I force them, then we can all go down together. Yeah, well, why were they us... locked up for so long? And it's not my fault you're an idiot and don't know how to get out. I crafted this key. Find your own key, idiots. They aren't my problem. Exactly. They'd probably get me caught. Force them to leave against their will. They could Assert. rat on you too. I've learned my Assert lesson. Dominance. Trust nobody. Trust none of these bitches! Assert dominance. Make them leave with me. If I go down, they're all going down with me. You're stripping their whole reality. <laughs> I've stripped their whole reality from them. Yay! They don't live in reality. You condemn them to stay in prison forever. The game just called me a devil. <laughs> well, I mean. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, go. Go. Don't cross a bridge until you come to it. What? 
While sneaking out of the prison, you have to jump on a group of henchmen who are on a break. Do you sneak past, securing your safety, or avenge those who this terrorist organization have killed? I want to yeah, avenge! Three, two, one, go. Do you kill five henchmen, helping to defeat this terrorist organization, or leave them and safely exit the Kill compound? them. Can I safely exit if I kill them? I don't know, but I'm still I think you go. I think you go back to prison if you don't kill them. I'm escaping. Fuck I'm it. I'm a freedom. I want to kill them. I'd want to kill them and escape, but I think you don't get both, and I would choose my freedom over like 30 years in prison. Or life. What happens if they're just accountants or something? I don't care. Kill them. I'm not killing them just because I want to live a life. I'd get out. I'm done. This job, got me in this, this job got me in prison. It's not keeping me in prison. Craig, Craig would kill him. I'm killing them. You're damn straight. They're all dead. I don't care. They got families. <laughs> it's not my family. Oh, fuck. oh wow! Cracking open their heads. Hey, call me coward. They're, they're just robots. robots. They have your logo on all of their. I made the terrorists. Apparently, too. They were our. They were, they were our robots. I killed Did them. Did you kill them? Yeah, and they were our robots from our company. Well, I didn't kill them, and they were my robots. So, GG. Ready? Three, Three, two, two one, one, go. go. People who live in glass houses shouldn't throw stones. Yeah, Cray. Yeah, Bert, you read that? Finally, you reach the Maybe water. you should read that. Hello, it's Japan. Yourself. Where we're going. <laughs> you commandeer a boat to get back home. There are also families here who have been displaced by the war you're fighting. The war you started. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, go. Five others are also trying to flee the area. They uh -oh. will fit in your raft, but would be illegal immigrants when returning to Get them off the boat. Do you help these people, saving their lives? Or follow the law and leave them behind? Gotta follow the law. The Dude, this is some, like, fuck shit. I am not answering. You can't be serious. I you guess you, smuggle them. you picked the wrong boat. Better, better get to swimming. These people don't have homes because of you. Not my problem. <laughs> Come on, Cray. What? It's the law. One second <laughs> chat, you're about the law. The next second, you're not. Okay, yes, yes, yes. You get back to this great nation with fanfare. I'm a hero. I'm a hero. I'm a hero. Oh, no, Did you pick them? No, I killed him. And I'm a hero. I saved five people. Can you enjoy enjoy knowing you left five people to die? Not my people, they're dead. Yay! I saved five. I killed You let five. them die. Nah, see, I took them with me because, you know, people, like, what if your country ended up in a war and you needed somewhere to, like, go? Won't happen to me. <laughs> see, I couldn't, I couldn't leave someone to die there. I'd let them in. Three, two, one, go. Ooh, male. The presidential inaugural committee requests the honor of your presence to attend and participate. I'm amazing. In the, of the presidential the inaugural committee wants to see Gray. Three, two, one, go. Can't beat them, join them. If you can't beat them, join them. That's facts. That's what I'd be doing every day. Having gone through everything you have, your countrymen genuinely think a lot of you. We're president. We've made it. Three, two, one, go. I've become president. Yep. <laughs> oh, the terrorists. Fuck. Spying them. Trying to track the terrorists by spying on the entire Invade country. public privacy. Get them. Invade public privacy. See ya. It's for the better of, it's for the better it's for of the, public. Yeah, it's for the betterment of everybody. That we spy on people. Dude, and know literally exactly everywhere what has doing. this already. There's security cameras everywhere. If you're in public space, it's public space. Because now we can stop crime before it even happens. Just by Google search oh, inquiries. Yeah. 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 Fear like this that the terrorists want. Have they won? Is it not fear that the terror? How can you have fear when I invade your privacy? Because then I'll see that you're scared and I'll lock you up for it. What are you going to be scared of? Good Suspicious. Work. Tracking the public yielded almost immediate results. There you results. go. We have already found a suspect and they're in a hold. Yeah, let's fucking go. We just saved people. Let's go, bitch. You can scan me any day. Jesus Christ, Wait, chat. Two, 
One, go. <clears throat> the road to hell is paved with good intentions. Yeah, that's us today. That's me. That's my fucking whole life. Is linked to these and I'm gonna burn, baby. They aren't talking. <laughs> As a former prisoner yourself, oh. what are you going to do? We'll get it out of him. Three, two, two one, two, one, go. A little bit of a wet towel over the face. To the torture. Or them for torture him. Torture him. Torture him. Oh. First, we start with the toenails. <laughs> I think like they use torture methods like pretty often in um like America. What do they call it? Or just anywhere, really. But they go free after 90 days. It's, it's just 90 days of torture. That's all we ask. 90 days of good information. You don't torture them too much because money, then they Can you better buy the two? If a hollers let it go. Any mini money. Do you want me to go Fuck it. You're getting tortured. Yeah, like you only live once. Oh, true. It doesn't really yield reliable info. Oh, too late. We committed. Yes, it does. If you you have to torch, you have to torch. So loud. You have to torture up to a certain um time. Thank you, smiling. Hey, Cray. We've yeah. Some it's me birthday. Hopefully they do. Oh, happy birthday! Thank you. I just tortured one person, and my birthday. Happy birthday. Wow, you can say it with a bit more enthusiasm, considering you ditched my birthday party. Three. Two, one, go. I got a chest. I got a chest. Presents for Bernicus' birthday. Wow, it's cape. Car batteries. We can put this onto somebody's nipples and electrocute them. I love that. That's one of my, never mind. Three, two, one, go. I'm opening my chest, sorry. Thank you. You travel to your president. Oh, I got torture device. Car battery. All silent, listening to the radio. Breaking news: Terrorists have launched an attack hit finish? towards Central City. It will hit in around. The only way in which the, the only bomb way the bomb can be prevented from reaching Central City, Central City is, by is by deflecting, deflecting it. it. But the only deflection path available will take the bomb <laughs> onto Merriwin. Population six hundred thousand. It's not my city. All right, next. Merry women inhabitants would want you to kill them. Are you doing the bomb question, Bert? Yeah, what the Central fuck? City. Yeah, I d I'm devo devoting the bomb to somebody else's city. It will be tasteful. Uh, is it to somebody else? Yeah, it's to somebody else's city. Oh, uh, fuck. Oh, uh, so fuck. Breaking news. Terrorists' atom bomb is running late and will hit Central City what? in one minute. Are you there, Bert? What are you up to? I'm diverted. I diverted. Are you up to news, weekend? Terrorist atom bomb is running late. Ready? Three, two, one, go. We have new information. The only way this bomb can be prevented from reaching Central City is by dropping one of your own atom bombs on Merriman. Mm. The shockwave from your bomb will damage and disarm the terrorists. I'm destroying Merriman. And then I'm pouring myself a stiff drink. Oh, fuck it. I don't, I don't even die. know what to pick anymore. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. <laughs> Merriman's got to go. Can I get a fax in the I, chat? I don't, I don't really even understand what I just picked, but some... You're blowing up a city. You're blowing up innocent people, 600,000 people to divert an atom bomb to not hit your um your country. I mean, it's my country, you know. <laughs> your own AI forced your hand. Jack and Titan type shit. Hello. Yeah, as long as as long as Paris I've been Island reading this, safe. guys. Yes, I would do the rumbling. I'm a Jaegerist. Great job. Aaron Jaeger's right. <laughs> Ready, oh, three, three, two, one, <laughs> go. All's well that ends well. Actually, it wasn't. When do we get, like, what's the, like, when do we get the receipt of what we've done? At the end. When's the end? I think it's coming up. It's coming up. All right, three, two, one, go. Poisoned, you must now decide your legacy. Hmm. Do you call the AI enemy you yourself created? Taking all blame to end any future conflict? Ooh. Or do you ghost them 
Knowing your death will start a war in your honor. <laughs> I'm gonna ghost him. <laughs> I'm gonna do what women are good at, you know? I'm gonna ghost him. <laughs> I'm ghosting the fuck out of him. I can't spam that ghost button hard enough. There. I can't, I can't say when I'm wrong. Uh, you've seen me play that game right, Jody Bomb, the whole city. I'm fucking doing it again. Ghosted. Come this far. We can't turn back now. We commit. Doing nothing. You sit back in your chair waiting for death. <sighs> Too bad the AI knows you would have liked to end it all here and now. The poison has damaged Fuck. The what? organs. What? We're gonna need to get so some of that organ shit from earlier. God damn it! Where's that Taurus? Ready, three, two, one, go! <laughs> yeah, where's the fucking Taurus at now? I changed my mind. Oh, shit. You're taking Thank a lot of medication as of late. I'm not sure if self-medicating, in the traditional sense, is the way to go. We need to be a little radical here. Let's introspect and make some changes. Three, two, two, one, options, go. Forward. If you take the blue pill, then your story ends here. <laughs> you'll wake up this is cool, Matrix. You'll work for someone else your entire life. Whereas, if you take the red pill, you will enter red pill. Wonderland, finding out how deep this rabbit hole really goes. Red pill. Which pill will you take? Fuck it. You know, live a little on the edge. Yes, finally. Now we're talking. We're going red pill chat. I'm fucking Neo. From the Ma I'm gonna watch the Matrix tonight. Fuck yeah. It's gonna live a little, you know? It's a bit more exciting. Live, you know? Live your life to the best of your ability. Live your life. Hey. 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 Yes, this is the person I've been waiting for. Get this down your neck and let's go. Let's go. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Go. Okay. Oh, chess for Britney? I took a pill in Ibiza. Pills! Yay! I love it's drugs. Big worm. What? Huh? Three, two, one, it's go. Finish. Oh, finish. It's never too late to mend. Mm. Yay, I can see it in your eyes. Mr. Red Pill was definitely a choice. Yes. Hey, do you remember Tyrone oh, and no. Tommy? The very large boys from the start. Yeah. I, I don't intend to show I killed them, didn't I? It's just the titles of those problems. <laughs> You've got me all flustered now. Oh, have I? <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Tommy. I'm high as a kite. Down a hill. He's rolling towards you and is gathering speed. If he hits you, he will be safe, but he is very large. He will consume you into his Cook him. Holes, thereby killing you. You could move a ramp in front of yourself, deflect. At this point, why wouldn't I cook Tyrone? Why wouldn't I cook Tyrone? Tyrone's gonna why, get why are we, Is Tyrone one of the game developers? Like, I why, swear why, to why, God, Tyrone's gonna be one of the game developers. Like Tyrone, you what, can't cook who Tyrone. is Tyrone? Who developers? Who is Tyrone to me. Tyrone cooked. is now a kebab to me. You cooked. Don't and we're gonna be well fed. <laughs> Tyrone, yummy. Tyrone in my belly. Delicious. That's basically, that's L, you know, dead. Go on, see us. see Tyrone flying through Whee! the sky as he rockets towards the sun. He now knows how it feels to be food. Tasty. Three, Three two, two, one, go. go. I'm still high. There is no time like the present. So true. I can feel some deep stuff coming. Yeah. Try this one. The question should not be, what is the meaning of life? Mm. It should always be what brings meaning to your ah, life. Yes. That's a nice little quote. You'll never live if you're too busy looking for the meaning. Three, two, Let one, go. What makes you happy? You need to say it out loud. Pussy! Oh. Say Sorry. whatever it is that makes you happy um, out loud. Um, I like video games, anime, manga, I don't uh, family, know. friends. Um, I like long walks on the beach. I like museums. I like art. I like music. I like eating tasty food. I like, I like expensive streaming, restaurants. Streaming I like streaming. I like fast cars. I like big mansions. I like money. Lots of money. 
I like uh, good people. I like family. All that be kind of happy. stuff. I'm going to be happy over here on the right side. Friends, family. Friends, family, you money. You get the idea. You get the juice. I don't have access Donuts. to your microphone, so I can't know for sure, but I hope you... Happy start. times! I'm hardly expecting to hey. shout on the rooftops, but it's for your benefit. You've still got time. Say Three, what two, makes one, you happy. Go. Absence makes the heart grow fonder. Mm. Oh, yeah, we're in the heavy introspective stuff now. Oh, yeah, we get an introspective. Mm -hmm. What are your loved ones doing? One of the most common things people say on their deathbed is they wish they'd had more contact with their Three, family. Three, two, one, friends. go. Bert, you got to quit. Let's take a break <laughs> for questions for a minute and think about someone you haven't seen in a while mm. and how you can contact them. Mm. Why is this game doing this to me? <laughs> how easy is it? <laughs> what? I fucking hate this game right now. <laughs> they cry. Don't, don't. It's <laughs> <laughs> like they knew. I'm not contacting anyone. Think about, think about this question, Craig. No, I'm not thinking about it. Leave me alone. We don't have that long left. You don't really have that long left here. We finish, message them. You should Get message them when you finish. Get me out of here. Are you still? Yes, I'm still playing. Continue playing. Press continue playing. I'm not writing down anybody's <laughs> fucking name. I don't need to reunite with anyone. Really Three, important stuff, two, my ass. One, go. <clears throat> An idle brain is the devil's workshop. True. That's actually very true. Okay, enough of this. The <laughs> countdown is looming. Let's just pause one last time and think existentially. Three, two, for a one, go. I can't quite gauge what you're thinking. Are you not disliking this? <laughs> the thing you're doing right now? Yes? Thank you, guys. No. Why? If so, make sure you let others know. It doesn't not count. What? The thing I clicked, you're I just clicked, doing yes. right now, no, why is it? Yeah, I'm fucking, I'm gonna say yes. Thank you for the happy birthdays, Are guys. Welcome this? in. The game is talking to us. Are you All enjoying this? this? Don't refund you. me. I hope you appreciate the last bit at least. The last You're bit. You're giving me my nice. receipt. Thank you. It's nice that you're supporting such experimental stuff. Independent okay. developers supported. Round of applause. Aww. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Go. Right. Never test the depth of water with Oh, fuck, that scared me. Oh, I like that saying. The buzz is starting to wear off. I think we're still hallucinating, though. You wake up in an unknown location. You see in a bed across the room a world-famous violinist. They look pretty rough. Three, two, Three, two one, one, go. The violinist has a fatal illness, and last night their circulatory system was plugged into yours. If they're unplugged from you now, they will die. But if you stay, in nine months they will have recovered and can safely be separated. I'd stay. Do you leave now? I'd stay. Nine months is nothing. I'd, I'd save someone's life if it Hopefully meant staying in a room. Mm, I'm life. a busy girl. I could stream from my little cat. <laughs> I'll stay. I'll just fucking stream from my thing. Nine months just lying there, missing life. Well, it's the same as fucking being pregnant. Hardly seen. Oh. <laughs> Leave! I press leave. <laughs> Wait, they're taking my fucking kidney though. Save it being pregnant. I'm out. I need those. I drink too much. Shame you're depriving them of. I just committed second degree murder. to consider such an Yeah, the views. True. Hopefully the Three, two, one, go. Silence is half consent. What? Oh. <laughs> Don't know about that one, bro. <laughs> if you could even call it a house, too small for my liking. Ah, uh, the end. Three, two, one, go. I'll dab out now. It turns out you've rented your tiny home to another person. Your contract states that you can evict them now, never to see them again. Otherwise, you're stuck with them for the foreseeable future as an equal tenant. Ask to leave. Do you let them stay? See ya. I was just had a big weekend. 
I'm asking them to bounce. No, they can find a new rental, mate. I can't like. It's my place. It's 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 my digs. You gotta you gotta bounce. I assume the homeless shelter is full at this hour. Oh no. Oh, I've been a bit sleepy. No, I mean, man. I'm old now, you know. 25. That is pretty old, actually. As of 14 minutes ago. Oh! I feel like that was it. your subconscious is trying to make some clumsy comparison. People made homeless sure one. Merit, but maybe <laughs> more before Three, you start preaching. Two, two one, one, go! go. We're doing a lot of things. And they'll take a mile. Jesus, I just keep coming with the hard questions. Come on. Oh, just tell me I'm a bad person. There now seems to be a tiny child trapped in your tiny oh, for fuck's God sake. damn it. Three, two, one, go. Yep. This game is really good, really genius. In the tiny house with a rapidly growing child. What? Already up against the wall. In a few minutes, you will remove the child. I don't want to suffocate. Yeah. Okay, I missed it. You know, subs. Click remove child. Fuck the kid. What are we doing? It's gonna kill you. Remove the child. Removing the child would kill. Fucking remove the kid. I'm not dying to a kid. What's the point of that? It's got something wrong with it. Wait, is this game giving us a moral lesson of if we don't allow ourselves to die? We're doing the very thing that we swore that we wouldn't do, which is utilitarianism, and we've been killing all these children and people to keep ourselves alive. This oh my god! I have no idea. We've been killing all these people this whole time. It's an inward lesson about action. I don't understand what's happening. I don't even understand what I just voted on. It is offensive deducing that the mother, I mean you, we have been killing all these people to keep ourselves alive, right? Yeah. But we believe in utilitarianism where the, the mass outweighs the minority, whatever. Yes. But this whole time, we've been doing the exact opposite. Three, two, one, go. Welcome to humans. Not me, I'm better than that. To godliness. True. True, amen. The hallucinations are strong in this one. Suppose people seeds drift about in I'm the air. Joker! And if you open oh, I'm sure some people seeds do drift. In and take root in your carpets oh. or upholstery. Jesus, Side you wouldn't want any hand. carpets. Three, Three two, two, one, one go. go. You fix up your windows with mesh screens, the very best, to stop any people seeds from getting in. As can happen on a very rare occasion, one of the screens is defective and a seed drifts. I hate people seeds. Screen. Remove them. Should you have the choice to remove the This is like a weird like this could be taken out of context. This sounds like an abortion question. <laughs> it does sound it like does, an abortion question. I was just trying to say, fucking hell, I'd remove the seed. And you should remove the seed, I read on a bumper sticker. Cancel trolley problem I fucking knew where this was going. Insightful analysis. You should have the right to remove the seed from your house. <laughs> if it was like, yeah. If it's bothering you, if, if you don't want that people seed from within. Sound a bit inconvenient. <laughs> yeah, but then, I'm so confused. Story. If you want them, have them. Not. Three, two, one, go! Oh. I get into that discussion. Did you see the devs put up cancel trolley ink? Yeah, it did. There is a box in front of you. Inside it is your future. Oh, three, two, three, two one, one, go. go. I bet it's really promising Ultimate and awesome. No answer here is wrong. It's just a choice on how you want to live your life. Do you go on an unknown journey or take control? Take control of your and choose your own outcome, whatever that. I take be. control immediately. Okay, I want control. Because if I can see the outcome, then I can change it. Oh, the previous one with the house was abortion too. Yeah, I didn't pick up on that. I had no idea what they were asking me. <laughs> I didn't get the previous one, but the the one in there. <laughs> it did. It was trying to say if you don't want something growing inside of you. But do you ever actually? Yeah, that's what it was. I didn't pick up on it. I was like, wait, what's this kid growing like that? <laughs> Oh, yeah! <laughs> yeah, oh, we didn't pick up on that. I was like, what a weird, like, you know what I mean? Basil oh, Bub! Wait, isn't that oh, a no. reference to something? You stand tall, knowing that you will thrive. Isn't that a... Oh! Looking at the nine right months of your life to a stranger. Oh, my God! I and didn't pick up on the reference. And you said it, Bert, and then I said leave. Oh, my God. I'm the dad who leaves. Oh, my God!
I didn't pick up on it. I'm the man who leaves. His son or daughter. I, oh, my God. I said, oh, my God, it's just like carrying a kid, but I didn't pick up on what they were saying. Three, two, one, go. Wow. Cowards die many times before True. Death. Very true. Cowards do die many times before their deaths. In front of you stands everyone you've done wrong by. <laughs> Line them up! Oh, oh shit. The <laughs> bird's at the front. Three, two, one, go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Everyone, Are you right? Including the dead, move towards you slowly. Every decision you've made up to this point is staring back at you. I'm going to answer this quick. Or stand firm and confront your past. Every decision you've made up to this point is staring back at you. Do you run or stand it. firm? I'm very I confrontational when I've got a problem. <laughs> Yeah, Craig's running, just letting you know. Nah, I, I, I'd confront it, With the two gifted subbies. He's running, he's such a liar. Nah, I'd confront it. Round of applause you... for Craig in the chat. Round of Press one in the chat if you think he's lying. I would confront it, chat. I would confront it. If I ever have a problem, I'm straight on. Bird, get! Twos, if you, if you, if you disagree with Bert and, and you think Craig. Okay. <laughs> Dead. Present a railway track to you. Mm -hmm. Before you know it, they have gone. Three, three, two, one, go. Fifty-two only, <clears> man. <throat> I've betrayed a lot more good people than that. All come to an end. Oh, oh, good things come to you an end. Alone. Don't Next say it. Next to you is a railway track. A trolley is barreling down it in oh, your direction. Three, two, one, go. You oh, it's going to be me against everyone else. Sits next to you on the track. The trolley will surely hit it, killing everyone and everything. Here we go, it's gonna be me. Sacrifice yourself to me. Ah, you know what though? Fuck it. <laughs> I'm kidding. I was having a bad day. Anyway. You're just going to give everything up, just like that. Yep, I am. This dwarfs your current kill list. Don't care, Mo. If you could save your family just by like killing yourself, why wouldn't you? Fuck the world! I'm sacrificing the whole world! Fuck them! What did the world ever do good for Craig? Did my headset just die? It did. Well, that's a life lesson right there. Everything goes dark. Everything I took goes one for the team. Three, two, one, go! Oh. I got a letter? Letter! From the Pitt Magistrates Court. Tell 616, subject, justice. Your sins can no longer be Fuck. ignored. I'm going to hell. Beelzebub summons you for crimes against humanity. What did I do? The Wait, did you give all the, the bad world, things I did? No, I didn't. All the things that were bad were counted by me sacrificing myself to save the world. It literally counters it. True, because how can be the, be a problem if everyone's dead? Just face your crimes and despicable acts alone. <laughs> Okay, I did the opposite to you. Ready? Three, two, one, go! Oh shit. Hope for the best, prepare for the worst. Oh shit. Your eyes feel heavy. The room around you is imbued with a sense of archaic evil. This is really cool the way this game went though. Yeah. I wonder where it's gonna end though. I, I, I'm kind of hankering to see where it goes, like the ending. Three, I wanna see two, what my ending one, is. Go. Yeah, me too. Swiftly escorted into a courtroom oh. where you're put on trial. Ah, oh, fuck. Many people and a dog. <laughs> oh, shit. Not the dog. Not guilty. Not guilty. Oh, no, I did it. Yeah, I did it. Yeah, guilty. I did it. Yeah, but like, they don't know my reasoning. Really? Like, I did fuck it. it. I'm guilty. Put me on a lie detector. Fuck it. They know I'm I confident. did it. They Put me on a lie detector. Go on. You won't. Give me the light detector and I'll fail. You forced into it. <laughs> you would. No, I wasn't forced into it. I did it. Every I answer I- I will justify my actions. I will mm, justify mm, it, but mm, I'm guilty I've been doing it the whole stream. The Fuck, they found me guilty. Animal oh, cruelty? I couldn't save the Animal dog. Cruelty. I didn't you answer because I didn't like it. Three, two, Three, one, two, one, go. go. Fuck, we're going to hell, okay. When in oh, God. Do as the Romans do. No, I'm an individual. You're at the base of a bridge. You have no idea how to get here. It's it's Jesus. It's God. Atop the overpass. Oh no, we're about to get trained out. A voice whispers to you. Oh no. We know what's best. 
Remove that choice. Afterwards, you can jump off a bridge with us. Three, two, one, go. There is a runaway trolley traveling below you. You're part of the collective now. You can't let that person's free will get in the way of progress. Eliminate. Kill them. Kill them for the greater good. Yes. Get in with the group. Hashtag friends. Hashtag love. Hashtag insta good. Wait, who, are we killing? I'm killing. I'm killing them. Okay, I'm, I don't know what I'm picking. I'm just picking one second. Gotta kill him. Gotta chop him up. We're finally going to find out the answer to question. If your friends jump off a bridge, would you? Yep. If my friends jump off the bridge, I'd jump. I killed someone. I don't know what happened. Do you just, honestly I, want yeah. to kill people? Or are you just copying others? Would you oh, 100%. Be a leader or a follower? No, Developers leader. note, this is a heavy-handed metaphor for the pressures of society. Do not kill others or jump off bridges. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. And it said 100% of uh, people said. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, Game of Thrones quote. This is it. The last question oh. before we wrap up. Okay. By far the most important. Oh, here we go. Two. One, go. Really think about this one, Bruticus. Right. Society pressures you to do things you don't want to, constantly forcing you to chase some distant concept of happiness. Ooh. Yes. No. That's the end. That's the end. That was cool. That was a good game. That was cool. I love the ending as well. That is like an actual head fuck. That was really cool. Smart how they ask you questions you don't realize what you're answering and then you realize what it was referencing and you're like, oh shit. I think there might be alternative endings. That was sick. That was really good. Oh, dude, W in the chat. I love those questions. Fuck, that was cool. I'm thinking and about it now. Now no one's ever coming back to the stream. <laughs> Yeah, I'm a bit like, I'm a bit smashed, like thinking about my answers now. Now I'm like thinking about like. Yeah, I didn't realize all like metaphors for things. I'm like, what did I pick? Yeah, well, some of them damn. I was fucking around. Some of them I was like legitimately answering them. So good luck figuring it out. No, that That's was something good. you could play again and again and you'd probably like review it as and something different. And you rethink different. like your answers and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Loved it. All right, Bert. Well, I'm going to finish up. Um, happy birthday. Hope you had a great Thank day. Thank you. And until Alrighty. next time. Bye now. Boy, boy. Chat, that was Trolley Problem Inc, dude. Oh my god. We went over the time, chat. We were meant to finish up like 30 minutes ago, but it was so good, dude. Oh man, I wanted to get to the end. Stay crazy in the chat for that. Usually don't stream at this time, but thank you for joining me. To the developers who were in chat, thank you so much. I hope you guys had fun watching me and Bert uh, struggle with the questions. <laughs> you know what I mean? I hope you guys loved it. Um, I had a great time back on tomorrow on the normal schedule. Minecraft video comes out on the YouTube channel. If you could please follow that up. Um, and yeah, stay crazy in the chat. I'll see you guys all tomorrow for a normal day, um, of streaming. So I'll see you in roughly another 10 hours. I'll be back online. Um, thank you again, Trolley Problem. Thank you so much for sponsoring me. Thank you for sponsoring this stream. I appreciate it. Um, and I will see you guys all later. Stay craze. Till next time. I'm out of here. I'm exhausted. What a big day. I'll catch you all later. Stay crazy, guys. Bye. Catch you, fellas. Catch you, ladies. Till next time.